it looks like chat has decided so far <laughs> the poll's not over until it's over so far the brotherhood of steel so I haven't started a new game with this um, mod load, but the mod load that I have, like I said, it's pretty much as close to vanilla as it could possibly be, uh, but still have mods. It has the script extender. It has the unofficial patch. It has a high FPS fix. It has creation club delay. That's it. Well, hey, Brett, thank you very much for coming by the stream, and uh, I'm glad you liked the video, man. Sentinel, good to see you, too. We don't need to sit through the actual intro here. <laughs> yeah, just small fixes to hopefully um, like have it War not crash changed. all the fucking time. <laughs> Though I think it was crashing so much during our last playthrough because of some of the mods that I had in... Uh, Oh, and then it immediately starts playing a fucking copywritten song, even though my fucking said, turn that shit down. Um, is the show good? I like the show. Uh, my favorite piece of Fallout lore is the Vault Experiments. All of them. We should play as a woman this playthrough? I don't want to. <laughs> I mean, it wouldn't really bother me that much, but, uh... We have to, we have a dick lord. Patty wants a woman playthrough. Alright, W in the chat for woman, M in the chat for man. Let's do it that way. Yeah, turn that down. Yeah, I agreed. But I... Dude, okay. Look at that. I believe women are winning. Play as an Argonian? God, I fucking wish. There has to be a mod for that. I see a few M's, but it's mainly W's. All right. Fine. Hey, my turn, big guy. Okay, so, um, honestly, this is the way Nora looks to me. I'm just going to keep her looking this way. Um, okay. <laughs> I know, super creative. Yeah, I uh, I do enjoy doing the institute runs. One second. I for sure have the radio like down down, and it's just out here playing it. Okay. Why is it? Grognak the barbarian and the jungle of the bat babies. <laughs> oh shit, I didn't grab the coffee. Dude, it's like... Stop.
stuttering. I don't know, it's weird. What happened to Tactics 3 in New Vegas? Tactics wouldn't work today, so I figured I would play some 4, even though it's being super stuttery. What's up with that shit? That is not how I'm used to playing it. I know we were nervous at first, but... Uh, Tactics gave me some trouble. Uh, I should have it fixed by tonight, and then, uh... I planned on getting back on schedule. I don't know what the fucking deal with... No, seriously, what's with the... That's stuttering. That is... Not sexy. What's my FPS? Well, I mean, it should be just fine. I do have a high FPS fix on. Uh, it's that salesman again. Good morning, vault calling. Good morning. Isn't it? Just look at that sky out there. <clears throat> you can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency. I don't know what's happening. Asking about the dialogue. Alt R shows in Looks uh, fine. Let's uh then I'm glad I opened the door. I have a high FPX oh, uh, fix to like you have no idea. make sure dialogues now go smoothly. I know you're a busy woman, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being, um, <laughs> the jerkiness isn't combined. too bad on stream. I'm here today. Oh, it's to too bad on me. That because of your family service to our country, doesn't usually do that. You have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Sounds great. Oh, it is. Believe yeah, we know all about just... this. The apocalypse? Well, hell, sign me up. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what to name her. Um, all right, let's see. We're doing charisma. I like the charisma in Fallout 4. Let's, uh... Strength is gonna help. Probably doing this as a build. Vag Lord, that's a little on the nose, I think. We, we had a fucking name for females, uh, female characters that we used before. The, the last time we played as a female. Because I remember um, I had Dick Lord with the E to make it more feminine. I remember that. But then we changed it. It did have something to do with Chad. Was it just Maxine Chad? <laughs> Labius Corpus is ridiculous, Jake. Minerva? <laughs> Minerva. Minerva. Minerva Chad. <laughs> All right. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just going to walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. I'm trying it's to catch it slipping with this fucking Are stuttering. Sean, there was one, no there was two, three, four, five. <laughs> what the fuck is going on with that? Miss Chad. Miss Chad. Go ahead, honey. I'll be there in a second to help, okay? Fucking wild. Maybe once we get out of the pre-war. It doesn't do that normally. I wonder if... Oh, fuck, man. 
my boy isn't giving his mother any trouble, is he? Hey, I fixed that mobile. Yeah, it is weird to see Nate on the. Give it a spin. Hey, I rate good to see you. Uh, yeah, fuck it. We just started the Great War by spinning this mobile, by the way. That's my boy. On his best behavior, just like his dad. Well, most of the time, anyway. Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Oh, right. The park. With you. Because I want to get pregnant again. Sir? Mom? There's a piece of lore. Come and see me. That Sean was conceived at a park. <laughs> Here we go. Dude, the stuttering. I literally chose Fallout 4 because it was going to be the one that ran the, like, best. <laughs> Should have just played New Vegas. <laughs> God damn it. We'll try to figure it out, boys. If it doesn't fix by the time we fucking leave the vaults. The only other mod that I have on that I don't normally have on is the creation clip display, so. And I have a save. We need to get to the vault. Now! Nah, 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 nah. That ain't good. No, 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 no. Okay, boys, one second. I'm gonna see if it's that creation clip delay mod. That's the only I mean like I have a high FPS fix mod, but that wasn't uh that wasn't fucking causing any problems before we played multiple multiple hours hours and hours we played fallout 4 the reason okay so we're at an impasse here we may not be able to play from the beginning with uh old minerva chat because uh the creation club breaks the game so hard uh and i have a save so let's Fucking, all right, one second, let's see if this fixes it. I deleted that mod. Now the only mod on, I only have two mods on, and it's fucking, uh, unofficial patch and a high FPX fix. So, I, and then you would be thinking, you're probably thinking to yourself, <laughs> well, wouldn't it be the high FPX fix? That's probably, uh, <laughs> fucking it up. And to you, I would say, sir, you are maybe correct about that. But it wasn't doing it before. So I'm loading this other Max Chad save. Sorry about not playing as a female. Do I have anti-aliasing uh, on? I might. But before we were... Look. 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 No stuttering. No stuttering. Everything's beautiful. 4K. For me, it's 4K. For you, it's 1080. But that's just because... I don't think... I have the power to stream 4K. <laughs> but you see what I'm talking about? Looks fine now. No stuttering. So, we're just going to play from this uh, save that's right outside. We know what happens. The bombs drop. We come out of Vault 111. Here we are. Some of the Creation Club's loading. We have all of the Creation Club installed, which is a bold move. Oh my god. There's so many quests. Hopefully it doesn't break. I say I've removed those corpses too because I'm a G. Um, here's our gear. Oh, we have the transdographiers too. So that's what we have going on. What? Uh, I want to be on normal, cool, looking good. Uh, display, looking good. Audio. Hopefully it respects me. <laughs> All right. That green is so ugly. You don't like that green? Yeah, we have every Creation Club cube. Gary, what's wrong with that? Uh, with the Fallout Four green? Default Fallout Four green. What's the What's the problem? Hey boy. Dude, the radios are not yourself? muted. Um. Fucking let's go. Okay then. Let's stick together. I always makes your pip you always make your pit boy blur away. Hey, those are some fucking solid color choices too. I'm not gonna lie about that. I like the Fallout 4 it lets you do it so easily too. Hey, look at all these creation club loading in. Um we should do this. 
There's a little stutter right there, but it was not nearly like it was before. I wonder if it was just that mod. I don't know. I don't know. Let's go get literally destroyed by these blood bugs down here. Oh my god, get fucked. Get out of here. Oh no. Oh no. He has my blood. Give it back. <laughs> I see Brotherhood is still, uh, Steel is still winning. Uh, that poll will be going until uh, we kind of get to a place where like we're deciding which faction. So that way we can vote throughout the run. Okay. Um... Yeah, no more stuttering though. Looking good. Weird. Okay, the Creation Club quit loading him, which is good. Some of them I think are just broken too and just like don't fucking work. Um, I feel like Unless they fixed it. I mean, they might have fixed these. Okay, we're good. We're good. Let's fucking go! <laughs> we're doing some real damage here. Ooh. They're doing some real damage here. Christ. So, hold up. Is that going to be better than my drifter outfit if I do... What do we got here for drifter outfit? Five armor. So... Road leathers is two. Right legs is two. So, let's see then. You know what? Now, fuck it. I'm going to keep my drifter outfit. Okay. Oh, Dogmeat got him. Nice. Nice. Excuse me. Smacked. Okay. Hey, up here, on the balcony. Our boy. I've got a group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us. <laughs> I don't know who, if anybody was in here um, during the last time we tried. Not the last time, but I tried to do like a Christmas themed holiday themed Fallout 4 stream and as soon as we walked into the Museum of History like all of the textures went away it was fuck oh man it was fucking ridiculous okay so there's a few things okay we're gonna have to get that up <laughs> um alright hold up Okay, yeah, Mark, okay, so with the tactics thing, um, somebody sent me a fix that I'm pretty sure will work for um, tactics, which is l legitimately just going through NVIDIA uh, settings and capping the frame rate. Uh, other than that, it, like at first it was like crashing every time I turned it on. I got it running, and then um, I had the multiple, like you get like an, an encounter every single pixel on the world map, I was having that problem. Um, so tomorrow I plan on streaming Tactics, and then uh, we'll be back on schedule. Tactics, Brotherhood of Steel, Fallout 3, New Vegas, and then back to 4. The reason I chose 4 is because it's the most like involved Fallout, in my opinion. Like There's a, so many different quests and so many different things, it takes hours and hours to play through. So I figured, might as well, because I could play through all of Fallout 3 if we didn't do the DLC. I could play through all of New Vegas if we didn't do the DLC. I guess I could do that with Fallout 4 too. I mean, if I looked at it that way. But it's just so involved that I was like, oh, you know. What is the best British tea? I don't have an opinion on that. I don't really drink tea. I've never really had a taste for it. Yeah... Bethesda's update is going to bork a lot of the mods, so London has to delay. That is true, but what it's also going to do is allow you to play Fallout 4 vanilla on new rigs with no fucking problems, which is going to actually probably make it a lot easier for 
modders in the future because they don't have to fix a whole bunch of shit and then make their mod. But it does suck that London has to delay for that. They are working so hard over there, and I'm so excited to see Fallout London. Um, I can't fucking wait. But you know what? There's been updates like this to like Skyrim and stuff like that. These modders, um, if they are still engaged with their product, uh, their projects, they're gonna figure this out probably fairly quickly. It usually takes them a couple of weeks, and then that kind of stuff is uh, fixed. So I imagine this is going to be a similar scenario, but they, they don't know until they see it, you know. I'm not a modder at all, I don't know, I have any technical prowess when it comes to that kind of stuff, so I'm, I, I don't know a whole lot of how, you know, like, how all that shit works, but judging by track record, that's usually how it plays out. I really like Fallout 4 though, it was getting a little bit of hate in the chat at the beginning here, and uh, Fallout 4 is one of my favorites. Um, I've, I definitely have my criticisms of it. I made a whole rant video about it, like, it's probably, I think it's one of the first videos that is on my YouTube channel. Um, and it's painfully cringe for me to watch, in my opinion, because <laughs> it's, like, so old. It's, like, five, six years old or something like that. But, um, I like the gameplay loop, and, uh, I like the structure of the game, and I like the gameplay itself. I like the characters. I like the setting. Uh, but, uh, I think the main story leaves a little bit to be desired. The main quest. Like the Institute, too. Open this. Nobody. Shut up. You don't see shit. Watch this, boys. Oh, missed. Oh, there we go. Hey. Douchebag. Good job, dog meat. And uh, I started recording my uh, review. I'm doing a review of each episode of the Fallout show. People were asking for uh, that yesterday a lot in the stream. Um, I started recording the first episode of that last night. Um, it's uh, a longer project than I thought it was going to be, so uh, it'll take a, a little bit of time, but I should have the first episode up uh, here soon. HPC with a fat $10 super chat. Just received my special cards mini nuke from Amazon oh nice nice yeah that's something I want to pick up too one thing that I really wanted to pick up was the Elgato fallout set that they just released and it is sold out now and I was like ah like it had the, like cool ass uh, microphone stand a new microphone a fucking like it, it was really cool but I went to look and it is sold out so hopefully they um, Uh, release more of that. Uh, yeah, the dialogue can be a little played out sometimes. Uh, Robbie. Though, that doesn't mean that I hate the dialogue, like what's Man, said in the dialogue. Are, time Every time. I think that there are characters that are well-written. Homer Simpson, smiling politely. Glad to help. Um, well, if that's true, oh, that's funny. Now I am wearing way. glasses. That's cute. As you can see, we're the <laughs> Usually I just grab those so that I have better perception, but now just like in real life. Please. Uh, anyway, um, a month ago there were twenty of us. Yesterday there fuck, were Fuck, I lost my train of thought. Oh, the dialogue. Um, I I was one. I was one that like I understand that the this mess. voice protagonist was a misstep, but it didn't bother me as much as it seemed to bother other people. It's good to meet someone who really cares. Anyway, we figured Concord would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. Huh. But, nah, well, we do have one idea. One good idea can make all the difference. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. You might have seen it. Yeah, Lost, well, I did watch the show. I liked like it a one lot. Of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. I'm making reviews videos for uh, T45 power armor. Currently. Military issue. 
I like it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might. Protection with an added bonus. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. Do that. And no yeah, I don't necessarily have any problems with Emil or think that he's like a bad writer. Oh my god. Um, I just thought the Fallout 4 is like main quest left a little bit to be desired for me. And I felt like it was decently similar to Fallout 3's, but... Minigun. Now we're talking. I know, right? It's not like ter it's not like well, it terrible. <laughs> like it's it's just it, it left something to be desired for me. Probably been dry for a hundred years. It can And be that Dark Brotherhood quest was yeah, that was tough too. But we're a bit stuck. I'll help if I can. But I even kinda we like the voice protagonist sometimes because seen. like during these situations when you're streaming, before. getting both sides of the, the conversation raid, uh, spoken out like that is nice. But I also understand like if, when you play Starfield, that's one of the best fine. things about but Starfield. Because so much of the focus it's for the dialogue the gets put on story building like with the NPCs. Look, well hey John, thank I you for stopping by, man. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Is the Soul Survivor a synth? Um, I've made a video that talks about the many hints that we have that they could be, but it's never been confirmed that they are, no. Can't be too hard. I'll see what I can do. Well, all right. Maybe I'll I forgot to, to grab the now. fusion core. Once you sure. Usually I have that by now. Excellent. Let's go bobblehead too. Shut up, Mama Murphy. I didn't mean to fucking Locked. die. No more British occupation. Back to England with you. Have your tea back, you. You have two thousand hours in four in New Vegas. Those are hours well spent there, HPZ. Yeah, she saw it. There, uh, Stubby. You're right. That is what happened. Good old lock picking. Much better than that digi picking in Starfield. <laughs> Though I've gotten okay at digi picking, where it doesn't piss me off as much as it did right when I started doing it, because I just felt so inept when I was trying to, like when I was first doing it. I was like, what the fuck? I've gotten a little better at it now. I want to. Yes. Okay, so now we have a little bit better lockpick too. All right. Got our fusion core. I only did that so that prompt would go away. Hey. Look. Hey. Sturgis may be big, but he ain't much hey. good in a fight. Hog me. I sure need you to do did this. find us some help. Just look at ya. He's a good dog. Smart, too. Oh, indeed. Dog mates good of finding folks who need him. And he'll stick by you. Fallout and Unreal Engine? Yeah. Just look like real fucking life. Please, tell me what you know. Just listen to me. <laughs> HPZ, I wish you luck on any self-improvement that you're working on. I do like the insert uh, soundtrack. Mark Morgan's my top favorite because I grew up with those games and I just love the. But uh, Inanser, I think, does a terrific job with the Fallout series. Um, uh, did a good job on Starfield as well. Uh, I really enjoy uh, his stuff. I think he did uh, Fallout 3 as well, right? Pretty sure. Anyway, um, yeah, uh, I love it. That's incredible. I can see. Uh-huh. Oh, okay, here we go. What is it? Mama Murphy, I need more, please. Oh, hell yeah, we passed it, boys. I see. I, I see. New dialogue you've never heard before? There shouldn't be. It's I mean, the... Horrible kid. The, um... Unofficial patch is installed. That's about it. The very face of death itself. I can manage. That's all. I need to rest now. 
And you have a job to do. Uh, what irate prophet? Uh, I can see your chat on Twitch. I mean, I'm 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 getting more messages on YouTube, so like sometimes you know, because I see them both put together in one chat box. Did I get the free Creation Club Vault Suit Pack thing? Uh, we have all the Creation Club installed. Oh, you've never heard that dialogue from her before about dog meat? Oh, interesting. Well, there you go. Up here. Boss! We got somebody Let's up here! Over. Yeet! Got him. Let's go, homeboy. Get melted. Give me your meat in your hand. Oh shit. Um Get to start a new horde, boys. These raiders are feeding it. Man, this time we're going all out on the hoarding. Hey, Paul Denis, good to see you. Never used power armor in a Fallout 4 run? Yeah, it is very clunky. Way too easy? Yeah, perhaps. I mean, it's just, uh... It's just on normal, guys. Calm down. Oh, if, em if enemies leveled up when they got a kill, there you go. That was a pretty amazing display. Yeah, hoarding I'm is the correct play, uh, way to play it. They're road jaws. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, okay uh, Dion, I can understand. <laughs> mutual, Preston. You can never have too many friends. Not in the Commonwealth. Brotherhood Listen, of Steel is still winning when we first the poll. Met, you said you were glad to help. Well, you did, and we owe you our lives. So here, it ain't much, but it's the best way I can say thank you. You're welcome. Anytime. Well, since you say that, maybe you'll come to Sanctuary with us. We could use your help getting settled there. All right, Garvey. I'm in. Oh, that's wonderful. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? I've seen it. I think it's way too early to wave the BOS flag. Don't worry, Patty. We're going to put your flags on the stream. <laughs> we'll be fine. Okay. <coughs> You're a man out of time. Out of hope. But 
all's not lost. I can feel the sun's energy. He's alive. I knew it. Please tell me where he is. I need to find my son. I can't see him. Not clearly. But I feel his life force. He's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. I've been to Diamond City already. I need more. I have? Look, oh, shit. I'm tired now. No. Mama Murphy, we talk talked about this. Ah, okay, we can fix that. We can fix this problem yes. really easily. That jump, it's gonna kill you. Ah, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the sight. Yeah, Irate, I'm hoping that we see characters from the game in the show. But now if you look at the map, we don't have every location discovered. The reason that had happened is I probably used this save to make a video. We're heading for that place, Mama Murphy. Then what are my... Just to make sure, what are my stats? Do they look normal? Yes, okay. Strength is only boosted this high because I'm wearing she power armor. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? it oh, hold on, hold on. Worse than Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together. Hey, Daniel, right. honest question, awesome. why... Do you think that when I, in, like, my insisting Anybody? on praising it isn't just because I enjoy well, the show and don't think that it butchered any part of the is. franchise? Let's just hope it Todd Howard didn't... First off, Todd Howard didn't write the show. He just said that it was canon. Uh, <laughs> secondly, the story told in the show was fantastic. It didn't retcon uh, any part of uh, the games that matter at all. Um, if you're insisting on this argument that another creator has made and people seem to reg be regurgitating all over the internet that it has retconned New Vegas. I have made a video that I think sums up why I don't think it did that pretty well. I just like the show. I don't know why that would be too hard to believe. It's a show set in the Fallout universe. Fallout is like one of my favorite things of all time. Um, it didn't butcher anything. The end. <laughs> the, the show was fantastic. There's a special dialogue if you talk to Codsworth for the first time after destroying the Yeah, 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 I've, I've seen that. Okay, so let's... this on this thing and we could probably repair all of them maybe this is the biggest argument like one of the, one of the biggest arguments i have for like Anybody who's like an OG of Fallout wouldn't like the show because it what it ruined the show, it ruined the games, whatever, it wreck on this and that, whatever. Is Tim Kane watched the entire show, the guy who created Fallout, and said, Hey, this is really good, and I enjoy this show. And it is faithful to the series and respects the IP. He he created Fallout. So there there's an opinion I trust about it pretty pretty hard too. Is uh, my friend Tim Kane's, <laughs> so I don't know, man. I'd love to see Harold in the show. I think he canonically died in three, unfortunately, but I would love to see him in the show. We need to go up and discover that location. I also believe another thing that I did was use uh, console commands to scrap everything in Sanctuary. That is something that uh, I may do with other settlements as well. I enjoy Fallout 4. Uh, yeah, so you're saying it's underrated. I don't know if it's underrated. I think it got a lot of praise and a lot of players uh, played it and enjoyed it and bought it. But uh, 
I do, I'm just discovering all these locations that we should have already, because I had to reset our map. You think Diamond City is quite boring? I can understand it. Well, and it's like, you don't have to agree, like, because someone said, if someone who created Fallout said it was good, then it's good enough. Like, uh, you don't have to, like, agree with Tim Kaine's take just because he created Fallout. But what I'm saying is, like, the argument of, like, you're not a real fan of the games if you like the show and you don't care about the lore and yada yada is, like, I'm, I'm pretty sure that guy cares about the games. <laughs> like, and so, like, I, I just don't believe that argument. What is retconned other than the ghoul meds and vault tech? Uh, nothing. I mean, there's inconsistencies. There's, like, inconsistencies that, uh, honestly, I, like, it, they don't really bother me. One of the biggest inconsistencies is, um, the bombs dropped in Boston, like, early morning. Sun had just come up looking kind of thing. I forget exactly what time it was, but they do have a set time. October 23rd, 2077, you know, early in the morning. But then um, we see L.A. in the show and the bombs drop at like 2 in the afternoon. Gunshots over here. And it seems like a lot of people are just mad because of the fate of the NCR and it's like... Literally everything pointed to that was probably going to happen anyway. From, like, every person who's ever written for Fallout, uh, citing that the NCR were headed for destruction. What other inhabitants are in 31 waiting to wake up? I, I believe there's some, like, nameplates and stuff like that, but I didn't catch them myself. I am rewatching it for my reviews. I'm gonna sleep until the morning. Let's see. No, Ch Shady Sands, okay, first off, again, this is, the the reason it gets a little frustrating is because I've explained this in my video, and if you watch the show, anybody with a passing elementary school knowledge of timelines would realize that that's not the case. I really wish a certain creator <coughs> that I've always butted heads with <laughs> didn't just fucking release a video based on a fucking chalkboard image so that a bunch of people would just watch his video and then fucking spam the same thing that uh, Shady Sands was destroyed before the events of New Vegas. For all we know, it could have happened after the second battle of Hoover Dam. It could have happened any time between 2277 and 2296 where the show's taking place. Um, also, not really, because Max is a kid, so you would think that probably... It, like it, it, like if, you, if I'm not gonna sit here and try to do all the math on that shit, but an inconsistency at the worst, misunderstanding from the fans at the best. Like it says, the fall of Shady Sands, which could mean a number of things. Twenty two seventy seven. Then there is a timeline arrow furthering the timeline, showing a nuke on the next part of the timeline, meaning that in the future, past twenty two seventy seven. The nuke fell. It's seriously not that fucking complicated to under- Like, I don't understand why how- So many people are having such a big fucking problem with this. You literally learn this in fucking elementary school. If the nuke fell in 2277, it would have said 2277 by the fucking nuke. And some people point out, well, like, it's pointing to the nuke, meaning that the fall of shitty sands means- that It's like, that's not how a timeline fucking works. And even if that's not the case, even if the bombs dropped in 2277, and it not being mentioned in New Vegas, who fucking cares? Like, it doesn't negate New Vegas at all. It doesn't retcon New Vegas. It doesn't change the events of New Vegas. The, the NCR are already out in the Mojave. They're already fucking there for the, the first battle of Hoover Dam, but then also the second battle of Hoover Dam. So Shady Sands getting nuked would demoralize the NCR, but they would still be doing their fucking mission in New Vegas. You may say, like, Kimball shows up and there's no talk of this. Yeah, probably because it didn't happen until after the battle of the second battle of Hoover Dam. Fuck. Also, just wait for fucking season two. Like, <laughs> it was intentionally vague. Like, fucking, 
Let things have nuance. Let people create things. Like, it's so fucking ridiculous to me that, like, nobody can even create something in the Fallout universe. It has to be fucking dead on right. If this date isn't exactly right, um, fucking this is bullshit. Like, the show's so good, and everybody, like, there's a whole group of people that are focusing on a fucking chalkboard and saying that's why the show's bad. Get a fucking life. Like, seriously, do something creative for once. Then maybe you understand that there can be oversights or there can be misunderstandings as opposed to just fucking criticizing everything you see based on somebody else's fucking opinion you see on the internet. So ridiculous to me. Like, Jesus fucking, like, and, and then, like, people come at me like, you're a fucking Bethesda shill. It's like, dude, I smashed 76 into the fucking ground because of how terrible I think it is. And, like, maybe it's gotten better now, but I still think it's fucking hot garbage. I <laughs> it's so <laughs> figure it the fuck out. Like it's so ridiculous that like we can't have anything in the Fallout franchise without somebody fucking acting like such a dickhead that nobody will ever want to fucking create in it again. Hey Kyle, good to see you. <laughs> uh thank you for agreeing with my <laughs> with my opinion. And thank you for being a member for 46 months. That's ridiculous. You've uh, supported the channel for a very long time. I appreciate you, man. Who's the guy on the internet that says that says all this? All you have to do is search Fallout Show Retcon, and you will see who has the top fucking video and who has put this out there for everybody to fucking gobble up and regurgitate. And maybe, like, he's, he's known for doing his research before. I'm not saying he didn't do his fucking research or anything, but it's like, think a little bit before you tell fucking millions of people that this show is fucking terrible because of one, maybe he didn't say it was terrible, I didn't watch the video, but you can see by the fucking thumbnail exactly what he's preaching on. And it's the same fucking thing that everybody keeps regurgitating on Twitter and fucking showing up in my chat and saying, well, the bum fell so New Vegas doesn't matter. Fuck off. Like, nobody's taking away New Vegas' events. That's not happened. The guy fucking showed up at New Vegas at the end of the show. If you watch the show, you will see Mr. House. You will see Frederick Sinclair. You will see New Vegas. Shut the fuck up. We're gonna be in New Vegas in season two. And I hope, I hope the fucking dust ending is canon. <laughs> so that everybody can shut the fuck up. I hope Vegas is a fucking puddle on the fucking ground. I hope there's nobody alive. I hope House is dead. Yes Man's dead. I hope the courier fucking died as soon as the second battle of Hoover Dam happened. Just so everybody gets fucking so worked up that oh my god. Like fucking calm down. Like it's so ridiculous. Todd Howard did this. Todd Howard is the executive producer on the show. Which means he does nothing and wanted a title. Fuck off. Your hate is fucking ridiculously misplaced. These people work so hard on that, and it shows. Like, the respect for the IP is off the charts. Coming from somebody who has literally been anal about this since 1998, who fucking destroys, destroys Bethesda when they get out of line with the lore. This is fine. Calm the fuck down. Jesus Christ. It'd be better if people were, like, making their own opinions about it. If they were like, oh, I watched it, like, Excel. Excel was like, I've heard about all these retcons, and I don't fucking know about this. And he's like, but I'm gonna watch the show. He comes back and he watches the show, and he's like, well, you know, but, and, and like, breaks down a completely yeah, level, like, I wish there wasn't so many inconsistencies with this, but Pretty that's, nice you know, it's not a big deal, yada, yada. That's how you fucking down. handle it. Make it a place anyway. Call home. I'm not trying to get all riled up, but it's fucking, it's silly. And, like, every... And, like, what you guys don't know is all of us Fallout content creators, for the most part, for the most part, we all talk to each other. I have everybody's phone number, they fucking, we call each other, we talk to each other. And we have been just getting fucking shit on for days because we like a television show. It's ridiculous. Like, stop it. <laughs> yeah. I used to like living here. Anyway, this has been my TED Talk. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I fucking love you, Beatles. Oh, and also, somebody said shows 8.5. I don't, like, that's that's a good rating. I agree. It's around there for me, too. Um, oh, I don't care if you think the show is a 1 out of 10. A 0 out of 10. Watch it, though. Like, watch the show and make that opinion on yourself instead of just, just woke up a deciding while. that Damn. this guy on the internet is the fucking <laughs> czar of Fallout, so therefore, you know, he, uh... Uh... He'll decide what my opinion is. Like, just fucking make up your own mind. That's that's the only thing I ask. Like, I don't care if somebody doesn't like the show. I don't care if they think the inconsistencies ruin it for them. Fine. But fucking, sorry. You know, make that up. You know. Let me know if there's any way I can help. Anyway, I am. Well, hey, Joe Wood. It's good to see you. I don't know why my stream's stuttering so much. But I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a. Hey, recycled. Thank you for the two pounds super chat there. Somewhere. 
the only chance to start rebuilding the Miniman is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, got my yeah, I'm the same way, Sinister. I was expecting it. I was like, oh, who fucking knows, you know? And then, um, it's not that people are helping. That's what the, uh, the way. And then it was good. <laughs> I was like, oh fuck. Is the stream stuttering for you guys? Are you getting buffering and stuff? Let me know if you are. I don't know if I it says I have excellent connection. Maybe it's just a me thing. So yeah, um Looks good? Okay, cool. Uh anyway, so I'm not mad at anybody who doesn't like the show or any stupid shit like that. I I want to make that clear. Also, I want to make sure that we uh pull the webcam down a little bit here so that I can not be blocking its uh nonsense here. Here's the okay, so so far Brotherhood of Steel is winning, so we'll turn that on. Um if it changes, it changes. Right now we're just going to drag these down a little bit here. Just so we're not blocking so much of that. Okay. Patty Dunn did it again, made these flags. So um, if a different faction starts winning the poll, we'll have a different flag up. Okay. I don't trust that. Let's do it this way. Okay. That should be a little better for quests and stuff to show up. And see, but I don't look at the Mr. Chino. I don't look at a. I don't look at it as a retcon. I think maybe is like why I'm butting heads with some other people. Is I look at it as just them them adding an event to the timeline. Like I didn't realize that well, that's a fucking retcon. But I feel like it's really, I feel like it's not going to be. In 2277, um, didn't the fucking events of the Divide happen with the Courier and Ulysses? Like, there, there was that kind of shit going on all over the timeline. That exact same kind of thing, but I don't know. There's No, there's nothing wrong with adding something new, but there is, you know, keeping timeline consistencies and stuff like that is important. I'm not saying that's not important, but... Like, freaking the fuck out over, like, every little inconsistency, I think, doesn't help the, doesn't help the issue. It doesn't get any of it done. Okay, anyway, let's, uh, need to talk to Sturges, I think. The synth. Do we have a level up? Oh my god. Yeah, let's work towards that strong backward. Wait, how much is my strength? Oh, five. Okay, that's not too bad. Alright. Um, Sturgis. Outside? Yes. Oh, we need to get our melons first. Okay, hold up. Hold up, Sturgis. We gotta get our melons. Uh, Panorama, uh, with a fat $5 super chat. New Vegas 2281, Fallout Series 2296, 15 years, I don't get it. The, okay, so the what there is to get is they're saying, because of something on a chalkboard that says the fall of Shady Sands 2277, and then a further timeline arrow that points to a nuke, they're saying that this major event happened and it negates the the events of New Vegas, but... I'd say even if the bomb dropped in 2277, it doesn't negate New Vegas. But I also think that it happened much later than that. I think it happened around 81 to 82. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Where's my fucking... But uh, thank you very much for uh that fat five dollar super chat and you're and no you're right on the timelines and people would be right to like be like oh you know this this uh this time isn't right but i also think they're misunderstanding what was written on the board and i also think that the canonity of the show isn't 
super confirmed either. Like uh, Todd Howard says that they view it view it as canon. So I mean that to some would sound like a uh, total confirmation, but it seems like he chose his words very carefully. Yeah, but paranormal uh, paranormal mafia. Thank you very much for that. What's the pay? It's three caps for each melon you turn in. Do you want to collect your pay now? What the fuck? It should let me sell them for five, but it's not giving me that option. Do, do, did we already talk to her? Let me think about it. Okay, just let me know when you're ready to collect Weird. <laughs> That's weird. Okay. Yeah, there, there's like the the cult going on in Vault Four with um. Hey, thank you, Nuke Man. Uh, with the remnants of Shady Sands as well. Let's get some of this shit out of our inventory here. Okay, pretty soon we're going to... make lockers for all this stuff. And like kind of sort it out. But right now I'm just dumping it into here. Okay. All right, calm down. Did we read the year special then? Oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe if I drop it and look at it. All right, let me see. Let me try doing that. Because when I scrapped all, I think it just added that to my thing. Nope. Okay. Well, fuck me. Yeah, see, and uh, having to do all these fixes and all this weird shit is part of the reason I'm excited for the new next-gen update for Fallout 4. Even though it will break some mods and, unfortunately... London had to delay. Uh, let me see here. Get our melons, boys. Okay. Get all this done. Uh, opinion, opinions on Maximus, are you talking about from the show? I've given my opinion. Um, I think the actor does a really good job. Like, I don't have any problems with the actor. I like to say that before I say this. But I just think that, uh, like, Max is a character. Like, as a character in the show, he consistently fucks up. He consistently makes poor decisions on purpose. Lies to people. Like, kind of tricks people. Um, and I just would like to see him get his comeuppance for it. And he never does. He always fails upwards. So, like, I kind of... Um, I wish to see him get a punishment for his nonsense, but it does, it just never happens. But at the same time, he does seem to be growing, so, like, I'm interested to see, you know, how he's going to be doing that. Alright, let's do two of these real quick. Then we'll put... One of these big boy generators here. Oh, on this island. There we go, boys. 
Hell yeah. Yeah, I noticed that too, uh, uh, Caster, uh, the, it seems to be good karma, uh, neutral karma, and, uh, evil. Okay, hold up here. Hey, Bobsy, good to see you. Let me see here. I'm trying to think of what else he, oh, defenses. Do we have anything to build? turrets with no circuitry that's too fucking bad do we have uh, these do this one um, there we are and you know what I kind of like the idea of one being over here too we're just doing uh, this bit of settlement building to appease our Sturgis overlords I want to trade a few things. I was kidding. I don't want to trade. Shut up. You are rude. To the melons with you. Let's see how much food we get from that. Five. It's true. I might not look it. But back in the day, I had quite the shot. We're yeah, gonna put him on a uh, imagination defense. Well, I feel like Mr. House kind of cares for himself and not much more beyond that. What's my opinion on the next gen update? Well, it sucks that London is being delayed, but um, Fallout 4 does need that update. Because as of right now, if you get, like, uh, I have a 4090, uh, an RTX 4090, and uh, a very decent computer, and if you just play Fallout 4 out of the box, it's fucking broken. So it definitely does need <coughs> a fucking, an update. It would be cool if Lucy hit Mr. House with a golf club. That'd be fantastic. Okay. We should give him a better weapon. I don't think we really have any better weapons right now, though. You're tied to this place, kid. Your energy. I hope the color of my energy is blue. <laughs> That's good. Humor is a good way to cope. Because this world... The next gen is delaying uh, Fallout London, I yes. Because they're making... Um, the site can help you. Uh, it always has answers. Just gotta bring me some jet so I can They're making the mod the update. We'll change some that. of those files. Bada bing, bada boom. Yeah, I was thinking that uh, Cooper's wife would be in 31 as well. I'll see if I can find some. My hero. I'm really trying to do better. Trying to, there was uh, somebody said YouTubers always have banger PCs. Uh, my specs are in the description. I am proud of it. <laughs> but uh, there, it does have some problems. I shouldn't have gone with Alienware, I think, uh, because uh, people informed me that I was likely paying a bit more just because it's named Alienware, and uh, there are some hiccups that it has. But it runs games just Sturgis. fucking beautifully. You to do some work? I hope those raiders. I love work. I can sit and watch it all day. Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Do I look like a carpenter to you? I don't know what you look like. You said you were willing to help. Making beds is what we need help with. I'd be glad to help. Okay. Good deal. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Some of these old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything. Hey, Sturgis. I like it. Having a place to sleep will improve everyone's spirits. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. All right. I'm, I'm on, on it. it. Clean water coming up. Great. Thanks again. Hey, Sturgis. I feel better already. 
knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. I yeah, I like the idea of those interconnected vaults as well, Muggy. I thought that was a cool little, uh, because we hadn't yeah, seen, at, I, I've here. never seen anything like that in the some crops established. fucking show before. I mean, in the games before. And it was nice to see a different take on the vaults. I'll start planting right away. Good deal. Hey, Sturgis. Well, this place is starting to feel like home. Now that we can grow our own food... Yeah, it'd be cool if they went to the casinos. I'd like to see some... I mean, if they're going to go to New Vegas, I'd like to. I'd like them to go to New Vegas, you know? Like, let's see it. Yes, what the fuck is going on with my nose? I'm on it. Ah, thanks. It'll make everyone feel more secure here. I swear I'm not picking my nose. There's like... Some, something right on the fucking edge of it. Oh, I got it. Yikes. It was just a monster nose here or something. Hey, Yikes. Thanks for doing that. Yeah, nose I'm picking stream. Let's do it. We have some defenses set up. It's been a long road. But yeah. I but I'm always worried it. too that uh, oh. there's a thing hanging out of my nose. So it look real good. I can't really see what's Ugh. Anyway. I was glad to help. Well, I appreciate it. Of course, you know you're welcome anytime. Would the New Vegas vault still be locked? Here. Windows too. Uh, 21 isn't locked. Come to think of it. It's a tourist attraction. Are you talking about filled with cement? I mean, it would probably still be filled with cement. Down at the bottom. Okay. Yeah, we're working towards strong bag. Okay. All of our workbenches are down at the Red Rocket, so... Might be best idea, honestly, to just head for Diamond City. I think so, Waffle Cone. I believe that, like, uh, they get their overseers cryogenically frozen from pre-war in one vault. Uh, the other vault seemed to be privy to this and got destroyed, killed each other, or got killed. And then um, 33 just kind of brought everybody back over to that one. Or, you know, brought some people back over to that one. We can have straps for now. Oh, I don't have enough cloth. Oh, we don't have a fucking trade route. We'll make Codsworth the trade route. Yeah, it's being. Uh, th there's a lot of things the show's super vague about, and that's why I've been trying to tell people to just calm down and see what happens in season two. If they continue, like if there's some big inconsistency in season two or they double down on one that you were afraid of, then be fucking mad. Then, you know, rage all you want about retcons and whatever, but I don't think we've ruined New Vegas like everybody else seems to think it is. Did Mr. House choose to make Vault 21 how it is? He did fill it with cement at the bottom. Uh, but what's her name? Sarah Weintraub, is that her name? Stays there. And, uh, I mean, a, a lot of the people left the vault, but she stays there. And I'll tell people to wait for season three. <laughs> no, I just said, <laughs> dude, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not here to argue. Like, you don't like the show. That's fine. I don't, I, I don't care if you like the show or not. Um, all right. Uh, let me see here. I need Codsworth stat. Where did he go? Where the fuck is Godsworth? I 
Hey, personal Jarl, uh, yeah, I vibe with Fallout 4 as well. Oh, you know what? He might want to talk to us. Mr. Chad. Yeah. Welcome back, sir. I do hope you were able to find some assistance in Concord. You could say that. I made a few new friends. Can't have enough of those these days. I realize that I'm no Mr. Gutsy, but if needed, I'd be honored to accompany you throughout the Commonwealth. Just say the word. No. 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 <laughs> okay, you. Oh, you know what? I don't think we have... We don't have, like, uh... The level to do that yet. Ah, so fuck it. So the next thing we need to get when we level up is local leader. Let's go to the Museum of Freedom. And we're just gonna head towards Diamond City. I feel like getting to Diamond City as fast as possible is always a really good idea. Um, do, 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 do somebody asked something about. Do I think season two will have new characters like the games? Oh no, I'm 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 sure we're following Cooper and Lucy and Max. I mean, there will probably be perhaps characters added to that lineup, but I don't. I don't, I don't think we're uh, gonna change from those three. Uh, for the foreseeable future. Oh shit, wait. Okay, data. Yeah, that gulper is fucking wild. Okay, we got some feral ghouls right here. Oh! Wow. Fuck a Rooney, dude. Okay. Yo, Metalhead Madman, damn. Fat $20 super chat. Thank you for all the support, man. I have a question about New Vegas. It's stated that Lonesome Rose tunnel Tunnelers would overrun the Mojave. Realistically speaking, would they be able to or would they be defeated somehow? Well, like, um, I mean, barring some kind of campaign against them, yeah, absolutely. It seems like uh, that would be a very plausible outcome for New Vegas's future. Um, something that I actually think the show might tap into, if not... Um, uh, an old world blues kind of situation. But uh, regardless, yeah, I do think they could. Uh, they are, like, super underrated as uh, dangerous enemies in the Fallout series, in my opinion. Like, I mean, we see them in game and they kind of, like, hurt and shit like that. But, like, I feel like they could really take over an area and do some fucking damage. Thank you for the super chat, man. What do you guys think about the tunnelers? Oh, you live in uh, Western Massachusetts, not far from Sanctuary. Nice, that's cool. It's always cool to like see areas that you know of or grew up in or live in uh, in the video games that you play. Like I, I always, I always get a kick out of that. There he is, boys. Wayne Gorski. Yeah, they're gonna bring back the tunnel snakes, probably. Would it be a retcon if they appear whatsoever in two in season two? Are you talking about the tunnelers? I don't think so. It would be confirmation more than a retcon, because uh, one of the endings to New Vegas talks about the tunnelers taking over everything. So I, I, I like I think there's a, there's a big difference between retconning something. And then, like, confirming an ending or something like that. But, uh... A lot of rats in here. Give me this. Bingo. 
Oh, Diamond City is now permanently added to our map. Look at all those rads we just got. Beautiful. If they don't appear. Um, no, I don't think it'd be a retcon if they don't appear. But, um, I'd be disappointed if they don't appear. <laughs> Weapons workbench. Let's see what we can do, boys. Oh, we could. Beef it up. So we need a long barrel. Ah, oh, cool. Well, still the Brotherhood is winning, so we'll do Brotherhood of Steel on it. What can we do with this? Nothing, 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 nothing. Nothing. Cool. We do this. Nothing. We do this. Yeah. yeah. Well, we're good. But we got a Brotherhood crazy 10 millimeter glow sight. What do they call it? Glow sighted heavy 10 millimeter pistol, but it's Brotherhood painted. Okay, so give me this. Make sure we're collecting stuff here. Because it does help. There was a newspaper down here. Oh, it is gone now. If you go back and watch the stream, I swear there was something on top of that toilet. It looked like a newspaper. Yeah, Olaf. Um, that's what I'm thinking. That's actually one of the thought processes that I had was that when the events of Lonesome Road happened, not Lonesome Road, uh, when, when, uh, oh, well, that, that, that was a different thing anyway. Yeah, I, I feel like it would have. <clears throat> okay, so... Go do that. Okay, these dogs are running. Okay, here come some raiders too. Hopefully raiders. Nope, they're gunners. Shit. Do I have... No, I must just fucking put them away. Whoops. Back up, buddy. Oh my god. Oh shit. What? <laughs> he blew my, he popped my head. Yeah, Jonah, you're right. Watch out for those gunners right there. You were correct in, in thinking that. Okay, so let's do this. Let's do aid right away. I'm gonna head this way. And thank you for the F's, boys. I appreciate it.
Oh shit. Hey. So what's your story? Looking to trade? Rob me? Or just ask directions to Diamond City? Just looking for love, sweetheart. <laughs> Boy, have you come to the wrong place. My loving days have long Oops. since passed. But I'll tell you what, wise ass. You made an old girl smile. It's too late, Jonah. <laughs> you want to do some trading? I'll give you a discount. Not looking to buy right now. What a waste. Oh, uh, fuck. Okay, so... Mantis and Oxhorn have plot uh, plot armor. We had a deal, Trudy. Hand over the good. I hope so. <laughs> I ain't giving you poison shilling chem pushers anything. Do you know what that junk has done to my boy? I don't have any problem square, with uh, Oxhorn Ain't anymore. Way back in the day, I had a problem with uh, make me come in there and shoot some flagging of some uh, YouTube channels that uh, he allegedly had uh, participated in. Whoa, whoa, easy there, uh, But past that, uh, you know, I have any problem with him or his content, but. You stop waving that gun in my face, or it's gonna involve. We have me. differing okay, okay, opinions on the easy. show, we'll lower our or at weapons, least about right. what a retcon in the crazy. show is. Now hand over your money, all of it. That's it. You're dead. It didn't work, boys. Blood of blood, Mom. Okay, dog meat has. Yeah. What do I think the best ending in Fallout 4 is? Dude, Institute all the way. What the fuck? They should win, in my opinion. I mean, I imagine it's the Minutemen or something, but... <laughs> I feel like the Institute's just the best way to go. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, she doesn't seem to care, so... We're okay! <laughs> I can't wait to see the crows feeding on that scumbag. Here, this is for you. Now. If you ever need to trade, my shop's open. You got things covered from here? Yeah. It's gonna take my son a while to get off the chems, but we'll make it. We always do. Now, let's get back to business. You need anything for the road? <laughs> Sawyer's uh, trashing uh, Not Caravan on Twitter right now. I love that guy. What's in there? Cigarettes? Okay, we continue. <laughs> Don't think I can pick this. Fuck. Oh no, we're gonna die. Have I ever gotten every perfectly preserved pie? No, I haven't. Okay, we're gonna avoid that shit. Thank you for the Fs. Yeah, that was a creation club thing, yeah. The Sentinel companions. I'm going to avoid it. We got a Radstorm coming. Might as well do the Corvega factory. I am not using mods. I'm using the unofficial... Well, I guess I have like two mods in. Unofficial patch and an a, uh, FPS fix. And that is it. Hey, Dion, have a good one. I should wear my power armor. I'm not prepared for this. Okay. 
Okay, on this level, we're gonna do our little, uh, local leader there. Ooh, I saw that, uh, Molotov come sailing by. You got more of those? Yes, you do. Ooh, ooh. They're all up there, we'll just go in. But, uh, let's... Am I a what fan since back in the day? I don't know what that is. Is that somebody's name? I've never heard of that. If that's a person, um, Bender Joe Cool, if that's a person, I, I don't know who that is. But, uh... I'm sorry. This is gonna be fun. Oh, shit. Scoping shit out. Okay. Excuse me, dog meat. Okay, this is where we. Okay. Here we go, boys. Let's see what we can find here. Taking fucking everything. Let's go. Okay. I'm catching up on the chat here. Yeah, I also hope I live long enough to see Fallout 5. That'd be really nice. It's getting worse. Huh? Arissa, I'm right Payback there with you. Time, <laughs> <laughs> shit. What the? We may need to armor up better here. So right now, our total armor rating is 8. Let's do... Road leathers with. Wait, you know what? It's interesting. Hmm. So let's do, I'm going to stick with leather. Okay. That's what I'm going to go with for now. And now we have 14 instead of fucking like eight. Ooh, fucker. Oh, 
There we go. Bada bing. Okay. Okay. All right. Wow. I know this is not survival mode, no. This is just normal difficulty, pretty much vanilla Fallout 4. Nothing special going on, just doing a run through of Fallout games. Um, we were gonna play Tactics today, but I had a problem with it, uh, so I'm hoping to do that tomorrow. Okay. Where are they at? Up here? Only a fucking coward hides! Got him. Surprised we are not over encumbered yet. So we are picking up everything. These coolant caps will do it. Oh, I guess not. beautiful and I got it back get out of the way get out of the way dog shit now we're over and covered okay so we just drop things like this Looking at what we got here, we can re-loot this place whenever we want. I hear a ghoul. And let's go get the bobblehead, and then we can come back here after a dump. Actually, we should go dump, come back here, and then get the bobblehead. That's a better idea. Maximize that loot, boys. <sighs> BRB just maximizing that loot. Dogmeat wasn't a German Shepherd until Fallout 4. What are you talking about? <laughs> I think dog, uh, Dogmeat started, uh, in, well in Fallout 3 it was a blue healer, but in the uh, the classic games, uh, it was more of a mutt situation, possibly closer to a blue healer. And in the show I'm pretty sure that is a German Shepherd, so that's strange. And also the dog in the show isn't called, like, Cooper calls it Dogmeat like one time. The the name of the dog is CX404 from the Enclave. It's not even dog meat. Wild, these people, man. Uh, I didn't catch the name of the elder, no. It's a... Bel what is that? A, Bel uh, a Belgian... Yeah, I Malin... I Manoy? <laughs> I saying that correctly? Yeah, whatever. A Belgium Manoy. Oh, well. There you go. Looks like it looks like a German Shepherd to me. That's interesting. Okay, so let's Wow. 
we'll do that. Oh, that's right. You know what we need to do? I'll stop complaining when there's nothing left to complain about. We need to build our containers here. Okay, so we got these sets of lockers and we're gonna use them like this. Weapons in this one. And I guess including the throwing ones, fuck it. Uh, we'll keep that, but uh. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna have these weapons here for a bit. Then over in this locker, we're gonna do apparel we're not wearing. Yes. Ooh, carrying ten of those. Ah, shit. I knew that was going to happen. Okay, we're doing all right there. So aid's gonna go in a fridge because that's the way I work. I guess this will just hold stuff like that. This, I have two high honey. That's interesting too. How'd that happen? Um, anything like this, it's gonna go in there. This kind of shit can just go back into the... Shit. Uh, uh, this kind of stuff. There we go. Okay. So we're doing pretty good. On that. Let's find Codsworth again. Who was the mystery person in the room with vault Tech and the other corpse? It looked like the president of vault Tech. If you go and look them up on the wiki, uh, wiki and then uh, you look at like a, a brightened up shot of that person, like they have the same structure, but I don't know. I imagine it's the Enclave. I meant the Enclave president. My bad. My bad. Not the president of vault Tech. President of the Enclave at the time. But also I could be having my lore confused because I might be thinking of... Need something? A 76 thing, but that would actually line up. <clears throat> Take care of your gun. Oh, You'll that's not who I was trying to find. Where is my boy Codsworth? The update is intended. It comes out on the 25th. Well, 
Oh, you get two from passing Codsworth's speech thing? Codsworth. Shall I accompany No, you shouldn't accompany me anywhere, buddy. This is what we're going to be doing with you. All right. Now we have a line to our other settlement at Red Rocket down here. vault is controlled by the Enclave? Um, kind of. They're, they're working together. But the lore has been changed. Uh, back in the day, I thought that the vaults were made as a test for a project the Enclave were working on with starships. But I think that's changed. It hasn't been canon in a while. Or was never canon. But, uh... They definitely have a, a strong working relationship, that's for sure. Yeah, since we're doing, it looks like, a, still a Brotherhood of Steel run. That adds energy resistance, endurance, intelligence. I'd rather... Fuck it. Now our backpack looks cool. The president was mentioned as missing in episode one, so the Enclave definitely at least knew what vault Tech was playing. Yeah, exactly. Oh, fuck, I don't have, like, any of this place scrapped. Excuse me, dogmeat. Hey, R. Dutt, thank you for stopping in the stream and uh, sharing that with me. I hope you're doing well. We're just scrapping some things in here. I'm not using scrap all. I only do it on some settlements, but right now I wouldn't do it with uh, the red rocket because I can't build those uh, workbenches that I have. I don't mind the big tires and stuff being there. That's for a nice aesthetic. All this stuff is fine because it looks very grudgy. I'm going to take that out. All that looks fine. All right. That shit out of the way. There we go. You know what? See you later. Yeah, we're just getting rid of a little bit of stuff here. I'm getting some resources for it as well, which is nice. Look at that. Um, I think we can scrap the truck. Yep, do that. Do a few of those. Like Starlight drive through I always scrap all. Use that command uh, for a starlight drive through. But, or drive in, whatever you call it. Um, this fridge is pissing me off, too. Alright. Let's. You know, everything in here, too. There's something on this. I don't think so. Okay. 
Uh, oh man, there's a lot here. Okay, he didn't like the Vault Tech rep. Wait, what did he just say? Oh, I see. Well, none of that matters. So let's... There we go. We're gonna put some beds in here. Those bunk beds from the Creation Club, because they double up. Like that. Then I guess we can do. Hey, what the fuck? Where's the sleeping bag? There we go. Put a couple of these bad boys in there. And back here. Just trying to get it to 10. There we go. Okay. I don't know if we have any food. Oh, we have a carrot we can plant. That'll be our only food source for now. Water. Just gonna give him the old fashioned water pumps here. Up to 12. Benevolent leader setup? Uh, no, nah, man, I'm just making sure that, uh. Because I already have the achievements and stuff. I'm just making sure this place is, uh. functional. I like using the settlement stuff every once in a while here. Um. Has no defense. But we can build turrets, which we need to do in Sanctuary. Come on, get up there. Oh, it would have let me. Aha! I don't know if that's going to be so efficient. Yeah, Jonah, settlement building, like, I think that they did a very fun job with settlement building in, uh, in this. I like it a lot. Carble Snarky, huh? I like the name. Then, Diage. Uh, because of a Sam Onella video, I can. Degen I, I fucking always have a hard time saying it. Diogenesis? <laughs> Diogenes? Dio Diogenes. Isn't that, is that right? I'm such a fucking dumbass. Do I have the donut uh, creation club? Yes. Diognus. Diognus? Okay, well, hmm. That is different than how I think it would be said. Diog... Diogenes. Diogenes. <laughs> okay, I like the way you... You spelled it out. Diogenes. Thank you. That was perfect. Uh, huh? You ask me. Freedom's always worth fighting for. Hey, Carla. Back again? Time to do business? Not interested. What a way. Okay, so, um... Came back up here for... Oh, yeah, to build a fucking uh. turret. At least one turret here. Oh, we have two. Okay. So we'll, uh, do that. 
And one over here, too. You got like 50 building ones installed. Yeah, but this is uh, pretty close to vanilla. We have like the unofficial patch installed, and that's it. We need cr crystals for that. Okay, so. Let's fuck off. Back down to. Do we successfully dump everything? Yeah, I'd say so. Go back to the Corvega factory. Yeah, I do like having mods as well. Bajelli is how I'm going to say your name. Bajeli, perhaps. Yeah, melon farming. That's what I'm saying. Except, uh, for some reason, I didn't get the opportunity to hassle Lucy for Abernathy for five melons. She just uh, immediately said three. I don't know what the, what if I had, I had talked to her and not realized it and saved or something. Then started the run? I don't know. Oh, shit. Let's go. Dickhead. <laughs> Think we cleared in here too. It doesn't fucking matter. Here we go, boys. Hey, professional loser, you have a good one. All right, let's see what we got here, boys. Hmm, my chair's bugging me. Usually doesn't. Okay. We have one ING, so that's actually not a good place to start. Slate. One likeness. One likeness. One likeness. Jesus Christ. Um. Okay. Rooms had one likeness, so it could be this. But I doubt it is. Two likenesses in going. Did load, load that? Okay. Sorry. Up. 
getting fucking phone calls. We'll see how the Protectron does it. He's doing alright. I was trying to blow those up so they wouldn't blow up when these, uh... So that wouldn't happen. Are you winning, son? Yeah. Check it out. <laughs> Yeah, Ranger, that was fucked. Yeah, it does always happen. That's what I'm saying. It's bullshit. Yeah, not just the the game just wasn't gonna give me the satisfaction on that one. I don't have to do this all over again. Okay, there's a lot of ESs. Through. Ooh, got it first try. Look at that. That's what I like to fucking see. No, oh, go back. Powering up Protectron on duty. Oh, now it's up. Approach and identify yourself. Law abiding citizens will not be harmed. Aha! I also think we should, uh... Oh, is the Protectron after us now? The dog doesn't need a stim pack, by the way. It's fine. Where are you at, homie? I just took out Jared, the Protectron. There he is. Rest in piss. Nice. See shit. Oh my god. Got him, boys. Okay. I think there's other things to loot in here too, like a first aid box in the back. Am I wrong about this? I always feel like there's a first aid box in the back. I feel like I've made this claim before. And the same thing happened. I 
Let's do... Oh yeah, we don't even have this as a quest yet. That's funny. Hey, stick man, it's good to see you, man. And Carble Snarky, good to uh, see you. Thank you, <laughs> thank you for being around. The name change is great, and I hope you have a good dinner. Right, here we go, boys. Got him. Nice. Okay, we're on our way to rescue the bobblehead from the clutches of the raiders here. Just playing some Fallout 4 here. Plain old Fallout 4. Where's that fucking coming from? Oh! Alright, fucker. I'll get you. Hey, we just picked up some corn there, uh, Stickman. There you go. Smashing him with that uh, melee attack right there. Raw tactics hacking and whacking and slacking. Chopping the meat. Thank you. Give me my repair Excellent. bubble head. Okay, now we gotta fight our way off this damn place. Oh shit. There's more. Where is that coming from? Oh my god. Okay, boys. I think... Let's uh, run to the sanctuary real quick. 
Am I planning on playing uh, 76 with my viewers? Uh, Batty, yeah, we've done that before. Uh, I just started a new character not too long ago. It's about level 10 or 20 now. Um, and I'm definitely down for that kind of thing. Hey, uh, FPS Burns, thank you for the fat $5 super chat. You want to be able to vats the groin again. That's what I'm saying. That's the best part of vats. <laughs> so I'm right there with you. I agree with you. Um, actually, that's going to be it. On that, go over here. Into the hole. Put away our guns here. Where's my fucking oh, okay? It's a boiled leather chest piece. We'll have that going now too. Whoops. That's okay, we should reassess our armor anyway. Okay. Up. Go ahead and hit me with that. It looks like we're missing. We have left arm, right arm, left leg, we need right leg. Oh shit! Look at me. I put him in the wrong area. Hope somebody got fired for that blunder. We put him in the weapon locker. Hey, Muggy, I hope you have a terrific rest of your day. Okay. Now we're in the right area. There we go. I like it. We didn't build our aid fridge. Oh my god. I was gonna say, I think there's like a Nuka Cola fridge. Which is that for our Nuka Colas. Then, just like a. Got here. All right, fine. We'll do a little bit of this action for the. Oh, okay. For the normal aid. Hey, Mom. How are you getting along? So anything that's not a Nuka Cola is going in here. That's like not a Kim as well. Love it. Getting all our shit organized here. I love every second of it. <laughs> um, there we go. Look at that. Nice to finally settle down after spending so much time. Let's see if we have anything for the misc here. Another grognag. I'm moving around. Oh yeah. All right. Spent a little time on the run when you were younger? Oh, yeah. You have. It's nine. Let's do nine hours of sleep. I should get another soda, too. 
shrine for the cob. Yeah, perhaps, Brady. Need something? No. Get away from me. Okay. Um... Do we have the ability to build that contamination arc? arc? You get when it's under resources? Not there. Power? There's a radiation decam uh, de yeah, decontamination arc. Okay. Need more fiber optics for it. But, uh. We should have a couple of things from this. First thing, this Vault Tech population management system is one of the best things you can get. Though, we will probably have to build. I hate the way that looks, but... What can they even do? Yeah, be assigned to defense, we'll wait. Yeah, I just do not like the way that's placed. You know what? Right here on this little corner makes a lot of sense for this thing to be. There we go. And we can get a quieter version of it there. Get a little level up here. Do we get the strong back? We do get strong back. Look at that. We've been going for two hours already? Jesus Christ. I'm gonna take a little uh, bracey, take a smoke break, grab a soda, take a piss. Look at all these melons we got too. Be growing well. Love it. Whoops. Got a gourd. We're looking at melons though. Melon. 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 Get this melon farm going, boys. Nice melons. Hey, thank you, HPZ. The small generators have the loudest, most annoying noises. That happens, Ranger. That does happen. Okay, we're going to do that for now. See how that worked out. It says 22, not bad. 12 food. Good amount of water. Alright. We're looking good. But I do want to make sure that we have... What the hell is it? Resources miscellaneous, I imagine. This thing. And then, uh, Siren wouldn't be bad either. 
keep the fucking Brahmin way over here. Out of the way of everybody else. Thank you very much. Brady, seeing me make a sanctuary a nice place to live is crazy to you? Well, I don't think I've made it too nice to live. But I'm making sure that we have some resource gathering things going on here. You just ignore it? I don't, uh... Sometimes I, you know, ignore it for a little bit, but I always find myself, you know, coming here and, uh... Making sure that, you know, it's a little livable here for everybody. These raise settlement happiness, and I like to have them around, too, so... We're gonna have... One of them, like, right there. I think is a very good spot. We'll put another one out here. But then, yeah, I'm gonna take a little break here. Here, let's do... Right there. Make sure we hard save. Okay. So, let's do it like this. I'm going to take like a five minute break. I'm going to take a piss, grab a new soda, have a little cigarette break. Um, I'm going to do this. But we're going to pause that music. So, forget about that music there. We'll go back to the face cam. Okay. All right, so what we are doing here is setting up some music for you guys during the break. We'll do some Vermilion Sunrise, like usual. So, we'll play some Vermilion Sunrise. Like I said, I'll be back in about five minutes. I have to pee really bad. Um, making sure we got all this going. All right, so I'll see you guys soon. I hope you stay with me. Um, thank you for waiting if you do if not i will see you next time and i'll be right back
We're back. Thank you for staying with me if you did. We lost a little bit of uh, viewers, but they'll probably come back. They'll probably be back. Thank you for bearing with me. The tune made your body move. You can uh, check out that album on uh, Spotify or anywhere. You stream your music? It's called Vermilion Sunrise. I made that and Waste Wave. As long as Manta, as well as uh, Mantis Sings Fallout, which is uh, also up. Let me, fuck, I have to do this to get this. Uh, that was fast, was it? I felt like that was a longer break than it should have been. Um, we'll end up heading through the quarry that, uh, what the fuck's his name? Mathis? Is in? Watch out for this rad stag. It's coming right for us. Okay. Yeah, this quarry up here. That's what I was referring to. Oh! Oh my god, popping up everywhere. Hey, Fichu, good to see you. What weapon is this? It's the uh, laser musket. Yeah, I probably wouldn't like Rad Stag very much. I don't like venison very much. I, I, uh, I, even a little bit of like the gamey taste, it turns me off. We'll be cooking up these mole rats in game the thicket excavations is what I was referring to here. We'll do the quest around here. Buffalo was super fucking good. I had some buffalo jerky from a butcher, a local bur uh, butcher. Jesus Christ, it was so good. I hear gunshots in the distance, but it's really none of our business. Looks like Brotherhood is still winning. Make sure to vote on that poll for who you think we should side with. Uh, the flag will change based on who's winning the poll. There he is. Sully Mathis, there you are. <clears throat> Looking to earn some cats? I could use a hand here if you're all done talking, you know. I could probably help for a few caps extra. I was gonna give you something anyway. 75 caps for your time. We'll push our luck. I'm not sure if I'm up for it. A couple more caps might change my mind, though. Not gonna make this. Ooh, nice. A, a smooth right. hundred right. caps, boys. What do you need help with? The pump isn't in top shape. But the railroads really your favorite out of the four? That's uh, actually a pretty unpopular opinion. Not a lot of people say that. Think you could fix them? The leaks will be underwater. Look for bubbles, and you should find them. All right, boys. Don't do this to me. I know you're around here somewhere. Well, maybe I'm the one that's out of touch. No, I was right on the money. Aha! <laughs> 
It's Garus's voice actor. Whoa, whoa, whoa. If I redirect the flow through here. Hey there. That's a ticket. You do the honors. Hit that switch on the end of the pump. Where are you at? Shit. Look at that. There you go. Yeah, I heard about Fallout London getting delayed, if that's what you're referring to, because the next-gen update. The next-gen update is a blessing and a curse because of things like that, but, uh... Hey. What the fuck's going on here? Why are you selling her? Oh. I don't want to. But I love dogs, and I got yeah. Ash jerky don't something. make itself. That's right. So Overdone. Raise them and sell them. That is 100% correct. I sell one, but then I get myself a new puppy and start all over again. You've got a deal. Oh yeah. You sure? I mean, she's a great dog. Don't get me wrong. I just don't want to sell her to anyone who isn't going to take good care of her. I'll take good care of her. Don't worry. You know what? I oh, what the fuck? I don't think I want to sell it just yet. Fine. Dumbass. Got it. Reading the chat and doing this at the same time. Yes. You love the content. Uh, did you like my videos? Is that what you're saying overdone? Thank you very much. I appreciate you. We'll just eject that holotape. Shipment log. Alright. We'll go into... I guess they're still in inventory. I guess they're still in misc. No? Are they in data? Sully's journal. There it is. Ah, uh, this doesn't really even tell us anything either. I look for the ones that, like, update our map or shit like that. Okay, onward we go. <coughs> but once we make contact with uh, Tin Pines Bluff up here... They'll be added to our settlement, because we already took care of their raider problem. And then we'll continue our trip down, we'll just mad dash down to Diamond City, get all that squared away. Can't wait to build that decam- uh, de- Fucking can't say it. Contamination, decontamination uh, arc at the <laughs> settlement so that, uh, purge these rads easily. If I told you I'm with the Minutemen, would you still want to shoot me? You're with the Minutemen? 
I didn't really think yeah, removing the creation club stuff is kind of a pain in the ass, traders. Brady. But honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days. After Quincy. Yeah, especially if you're on uh, console. We're rebuilding the Minutemen from the ground up. We're the good guys again. Glad to hear it. No question that things have been worse since the Minutemen fell to pieces. There's a raider gang that's been giving us trouble for weeks. Stealing food and supplies. Threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. We know where they're coming from, but we can't go up against a gang like that. I took care of some raiders earlier. No kidding? That's the best piece of news we've had around here for a good long time. You know what? I'm going to take a chance on you. If we want things to get better, we've got to start helping each other. So, we're in. You can count on us if you need help down the line. Thanks again. For Where should Fallout 5 be based? I'm not sure. I've always wanted to see a Fallout based in like the New Orleans area, but I feel like that'd be better as a spin-off and not so much uh, a main line. Okay. Alright. Um, I'll turn this back into Preston, but then we're just going to mad dash to Diamond City, especially since Brotherhood is winning the poll. We'll start working towards that uh, tasty Brotherhood run. Maybe we'll get Wrath of Bong out here, too. Let's see what I got. For a joint... Dude, I do not, for the life of me, know how to fucking open this thing. I wonder, do I just take it off like that? I have so many, like, barely smoked joints in here. I think that's what we'll do. Look at this bad boy. Looks like I may have figured it out a little bit here. Maybe that's backwards. One second. It's just like this little fancy ashtray. Maybe... No, that isn't backwards. One sec. It's not perfect, but it'll do. Okay. Alright. Where are you at, Gravy? They're not even really refrides, they're just like... It'll take care no, of I have uh, I have my pin and stuff. Somebody asking about concentrates. You know I have a little. You sent me to help. Got my pins they and stuff. But I, uh, the minute, I like the That's joints. News. I, knew you were the I should right actually have a new cart. By the way, you should have one of these flare waiting. Guns. But it looks like maybe you can I use don't. it to signal for help from any nearby minute. But I have a few carts sitting here. Not much here. use yet, but once we have more allied settlements, you'll have help whenever. <coughs> I don't think I ever told you what happened to the Minutemen. How I ended up as the last one. I figured you'd tell me when you were ready. Have you heard of the Quincy Massacre? What was it? I thought everyone in the Commonwealth knew about that by now. Where the Minutemen betrayed each other? Oh, you call any relight joints refreds? Yeah, this is like... I was with Colonel Hollis There's gonna be like three hits taken out of this bad boy and I just put it out. The gunners was attacking Quincy. Is there any real yeah, use for brain fungus in a game? What a good question that is. What a good looking question you got there, Gohan. The other groups, Let me, uh, I'm gonna look that up. Turn their backs on us and the folks in Quincy. Only a few of us got out alive. Colonel Hollis was dead. I don't know about 76, I'm looking so up for Fallout 4. Up the survivors. We never found a safe place to settle. One disaster after another. You saw how it ended in Concord? An edible mushroom, which is slightly irradiated, used in the recipe for mintats. For the chemist perk, this item is treated as a chem. So you can make mintats with it. There you go. Dude, it'd be actually uh, pretty dope for more Anchorage stuff. As long as you don't give up, the Minutemen will survive. I'm not about to give up, but I can't protect the Commonwealth all by myself. Hell, I could barely protect these people. 
That's why I'm talking to you. I can't rebuild the Minutemen, but I think you can. That means a lot coming from you, Garvey. I appreciate that. Does that mean you'll do it? Okay. I'll do it. Good. Good. Welcome aboard. Dude, a Fallout New Orleans would be really dope. Hawaii would look really cool, too. My favorite looking P, uh, power armor, uh, Matthew David, is the... So, if I'm a general, where's my army? Is the Quantum X01 in Nuka World. Lore-breakingly wise, it's my least favorite, but appearance-wise, it's my absolute favorite. was General Becker. After he died back in 82, nobody could agree on who should take his place. The one good thing about being the last minute man is there's no one to argue with me when I say you're the new general. Now it's your job to make it more than an empty title. I've got something a bit different for you. Our scouts have found a promise. Yeah, Zach is out there doing God's work, Once making new out, set up a radio Fallout live action so cool shit. Before you know it, we'll have a thriving new farm instead of wasteland. We'll take back the Commonwealth. One piece at a time. APA Mark II uh, is top tier. You are correct about that. That's my favorite armor in the entire series. But I was asked, uh, appearance-wise, what's my favorite? Okay. okay we're almost there. Do I like the big clunky power armor from 4 or the smaller ones from before? Um, I like the smaller ones, but uh, them being big tank, like almost like vehicles uh, that these people control, I agree with. I think it adds to like the type of armor that they are, but like the Enclave from Nintendo Summer in New Vegas is dope. Uh, the APA Mark II in Fallout 2 is just the best in my opinion. I have not already done New Vegas for this series. The reason I'm playing Fallout 4 is because I had a problem with tactics. I jumped into 4 because it felt like fun to play. Um, uh, the regular schedule should continue tomorrow with tactics because we should have it fixed by then. HPC playing 76. Nice, man. I hope you have a good time. I'm going to switch guns. I'm gonna try the submachine gun out here. Whoops. Since it's gonna be just a bunch of mole rats. I can already see one looking at us. Bring it on. really irradiated in here yeah Christ no way I could pick this I'll come back to it do I have right away yes a lot of uh, children of Adam over here actually watch out dog man. hey Jesus Christ come on get the fuck out of the way Jonah says, have I ever said I love your setup? You have some sick stuff. Oh, just like the stuff. Uh, yeah, well, thank you. I don't know if you have said it or not, but I appreciate you saying so. Um, I have a lot of stuff in this. I need to actually straighten it up quite a bit. Then I'd be more inclined to give you like a better tour of it. Oh, we do have a level up. I honestly might cr increase charisma one more time. Bring me some milk fruits for seeding, and they'll be cat 
Pretty ingenious. I bet you can work around the clock. Of course, darling. Our unique hierarchy allows for constant operation. You see, there are two kinds of robots here. The worker drones carry out labor and maintenance. We supervisors, that is myself, green and brown, possess sophisticated cognition processors. We are capable of complex analysis and decision making. A testament to the genius of our creator, Dr. Edward Gray. What became of Dr. Gray? Like so many others, he died in the war. It was a terrible loss. Robotics and artificial intelligence were our creator's great passions, rivaled only by his love of television. Perhaps you've noticed that I possess a rather singular personality. As do the other supervisors. Raw tactics, you know that I would pass it if I could. Really. Great. Just when I thought I was finally free. Gotta get you back out to Good Springs. When you're done serving that country. No. Talk to Green if you need supplies. If it's caps you require, Brown might have a few or jobs. Uh, there's one other thing. The question, really. Tell me, darling. What do you think of the water around here? It's awful. <laughs> Isn't it, though? Pressure is down. Radiation is up. Why, it's practically toxic. Just think what it must be doing to my skin. This will never do. I don't mean to impose, darling, but perhaps you could lend us a hand. Eventually. All right. Marvelous. Simply marvelous. Most of our water comes from the old Western Ooh. plant. South of here, such an eyesore. Be a dear and pay a visit, hmm? See what you can do. Maybe tidy up the place. It must be filthy. If you can get it working again, I'm sure I can come up with something for you. I'll see you guys are talking about Max's uneducated sex dialogue in uh, the Fallout show. <laughs> I understand why uh, people think it's cringe. I cringed out a little bit too. But uh, I do understand. You sound like a game show host. That's the correct answer. Well done. Ladies and gentlemen, should we tell the lucky contestant what fabulous prize he's won? Uh, sure. Okay. Right this way, please. Let's take a look at your fabulous prize. It's a brand new car! Wow! Now, if you've already got the latest in sleek, stylish, atomic-powered automation, you can also take your winnings in the form of a cash prize. How does 100 cap sound? I've got an idea. Let's make a deal. I like it. How about 150 caps? Tempting. But can you do a little better? Whoa! You're really looking to push your luck, aren't you? All right. 200 caps it is. I should warn you, asking for more could lead to Why is Max such a dweeb, though? Yeah, I'm not sure. He's unlikable. The character is unlikable. Like I like I've said, the the actor's doing a terrific job, but the character pisses me off like every time he does I'll anything. Take price. <laughs> Here you go. And if you want to use your winnings to make a few purchases from Robco, we certainly won't complain. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, it's been a real pleasure. Thanks for playing. Hey, thank you. Brotherhood of Steel is still winning. I don't know how much they're winning, though. I don't know, like, by how much they're winning. Um, so make sure to vote in that uh, poll there in the chat if you want to influence the outcome of the stream a little bit. The flag will change based on who we're going with. But it looks as if the Brotherhood is winning. Um, I think we did just pick up their signal over there, which is something I should have done. 
Let's do that. Uh, no, we, I don't think we know how old Max is. Though he does look a little older, I don't know if, like, the character is supposed to be as old as, uh, like, he looks. I swear I saw that. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's right there. to the BOS now. Jesus Christ. Early to mid 20s. This is what somebody used to say. Uh, Lucy looks a bit like that. Maximus looks a, a, like around my age, like mid to late 30s. Um, but like I said, that doesn't mean that that's how old that character is supposed to be. You could be 100% right. But Maximus looks older than Lucy, in my opinion. Not by like a whole lot, but like, you know, 8 to 10 years maybe. You know what sucks about not having our mods in is we don't have Tom Shanks anymore. The best weapon we ever had in, in Fallout 4. It was a broken bottle that caused massive bleed damage. In your what difficulty it is on normal. No survival mode or anything like that. Add Victoria. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Anyway. Gotta loot all this nonsense. Excuse me. We appreciate the assistance, civilian. But what's your business here? Pest exterminator. I heard you had a feral problem. Evading my questions is a surefire way of getting yourself ejected from the compound. Are you from a local settlement? Did I shoot Reese in the face yet? No, I did not. Do all these questions really matter? After all, I help you fight those ferals. See you later, uh, uh, raw tactics. It's, uh, always good to see you. Because our mission here has been difficult. Since the moment we arrived in the Commonwealth, we've been constantly under fire. If you want to continue pitching in, we could use an extra gun on our side. I'll continue to help, but you owe me an explanation first. Very well. I'm Paladin Dance, Brotherhood of Steel. Over there is Scribe Halen and Knight Reese. We're on recon duty, but I'm down a man and our supplies are running low. I've been trying to send a distress call to my superiors. But the signal's too weak to reach them. Sir, if I may... Proceed, Halen. I've modified the radio tower on the roof of the police station. Professional ghost, I have no fucking idea what you're talking about. I don't know what that is. Our target is Arcjet Systems, and it contains the technology... To a newcomer, what, what's the best Fallout game to start with? Probably four. Secure the transmitter and bring I'm being honest. So what do you say? You willing to lend... Four is the most, like, approachable, I think, for somebody that has... Let's get moving. Outstanding. I think it's designed to be most approachable. But uh, New Vegas is where you're gonna have. Halen, take Reese inside. And you're you're gonna fall in yes, love sir. with the Reese, series. Once you're on I'm your pretty feet, sure. I want you to make certain the perimeter is secure. I'm on it. All right, civilian. 
It's time to prove your worth. Head into the police station and resupply yourself. Then let me know when you're ready to begin. Let's move out, people. All right, big guy. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. I'm Contraband, good to see you. Oh, the penis. Oh, okay. Shit. Okay. I thought you were referring to like a candy or something. Like a penis puff. Like, I was like, what the fuck is that? You're referring to a scene in the show. Um, like I said, I kind of cringed a little bit at it, but I think we're supposed to. And it does make sense to me that Max, like, would be kind of lost in that department. So. Are you gonna patch me up or what? I don't know. Your prognosis looks pretty grim. Might be more humane to just take you out back and shoot you. <laughs> You're all hard, Doc. Just quit squirming so I can get these bandages on. Ain't no worries, contraband. Yeah, you don't want to hang out in the stream if uh, you're worried about spoilers for the show. We kind of pop off around here. Um, just looting whatever I want. <laughs> Which is everything. You can see out the window. Look at those textures. Mm-mm-mm. But it's cool to be able to see, like, shit out the window. We're taking everything. <laughs> to the other map cell in there for it but yeah we're just uh, gathering up what we can more low poly outdoors love it Yeah, New York, are people saying New York for Fallout 5? Yeah, um, that would make sense. That would track. Um, let's see here. Field scribe Halen, personal log entry, 324A. I'm starting to wonder if joining the Brotherhood of Steel was a good choice. I originally signed up seeking protection and comradeship. I'm worried that I've traded away a bit of my humanity in the process. The Brotherhood's message of hope for the future is idealistic and noble, but their methods leave a lot to be desired. The leadership seems especially misguided. Instead of diplomacy, they wield violent confrontation to exert control. Despite all that, I've been successfully avoiding the fighting by following the career path of the field scribe. I suppose only time will tell how long I can stand the sight of spilled blood over my own moral fiber. Okay. Sorry about the other guys. Why are you cutting me so much slack? I, uh, I joined the Brotherhood not too long ago. They used to be like you. Can I break down the vault map in episode so eight for a video? I know what it feels like when every Perhaps I'd have to take a look at it. I know that uh, look. 
My homie yeah, tumbles, uh, Tunnel Snake's Fool made uh, a, good a good overlay. He's just all soldier. Protocol? This is bread and butter. And Reese? Well, let's just say he's as hard-headed as a Mr. Gutsy. But you know what? I trust both of them with my life. Have I considered because modding slash creating my own world in any Fallout game? I thought games. about, like, for the classic games, like, like, I've, like, daydreamed about, like, what I would do for, like, quests or a story in one of those, but uh, not really for, like, the the 3D this ones post-Bethesda. Sorry, we got off on the wrong foot. Oh, so now we're supposed to be best buddies. Well, guess what? I'm not interested in making friends. You're hired help, and that's all there is to it. Hired help or not, I got the job done. Got some backbone. Good. You'll need it if you keep hanging with us. Yeah, I agree. Fuck Reese. Genghis Khan. See if Top needs you to do anything else. Okay, we'll do this dance mission. Paladin. Ready to move out? Ready? Outstanding. Follow me and try not to lag behind. Blue Elvis, you are not wrong. Reese is kind of a dick. Oh, is he not going to put on his helmet? Again with this. Jeez, it would be. Oh, oh, look at that. First crash of the stream. It'd be incredible to. Uh, be able to have a sit down with Avalon. You know what sucks about all that is I looted everything. And it took a minute. Yeah, that's wild. It sucks that that happened. Actually. Only the first crash in three hours. <coughs> so we're doing okay. I'm not going to go through and loot everything like that all over again, but I'm just going to take a couple of things like that. And, uh, this. And we'll just Paladin. talk to dance. You ready to move out? Ready? Outstanding. Follow me, and try not to lag behind. So you're going to patch me up, or what? I don't know. I'm pretty sure Practice. that noise that just played was, like, the noise of him putting on his helmet. Take you out back and shoot you. <laughs> you're all hard. This isn't complete vanilla, this is with the unofficial patch. But I'm pretty sure he should have put his helmet on because he gets we'll blasted. Follow me. And this happened in our last playthrough where he just takes it to the face. Arc Jet is a short hike to the west. If we take this road, we should be able to avoid the larger packs of ferals infesting Cambridge. Traveling this far from the police station is a risk. But getting that transmitter up and running needs to be our top priority. If yeah, maybe, place, Matthew, maybe that's the mentality. <laughs> but Scribe Halen detected some disturbing energy readings in the area that need to be investigated. We don't know much about them, except that they're short-lived and broadcast on a frequency only attainable with a high level of technology. We're concerned. That whoever or whatever is creating yeah I, I know he's a immortal so it's our job to invest uh blue of us he's essential during the quest I think he's essential during the whole game until that gets turned off during your own choices yeah we're just we're playing Fallout 4 right now happy because uh tactics was giving me a bunch of fucking trouble and so I'm hoping to return to the normal schedule by tomorrow and play Tactics and then Brotherhood of Steel and yada yada yada. It might surprise you to learn that my recon team isn't the first to visit the common. Over the last seven years, two other teams were sent here by the Brotherhood to gather technology. The first team's mission was a huge success. They came back with crates and pre-war artifacts and historical documents. The second wasn't so fortunate. Shortly after they arrived, we lost contact with them, and they haven't been heard from since. As far as my team goes, we've lost four good men to this godless wasteland. We've been a target from the moment we arrived. 
but despite our setbacks, I don't intend to give up and head home. Or end up missing. Oh, that sucks that uh, you were having uh, issues streaming as well. Do I think we'll see synths in the show? Yeah, we, we probably already met one and didn't know it. <laughs> like, for real. Yeah, Mr. Mike, thank you for stopping by the stream, man. have a problem here. Intruder alert! Hold up. I think we're being found here. Send them back to hell. My scheduling is chaotic. Now I'm just trying to do a stream a day to celebrate the show. At least play all of the games during the series. Um, and in the background, I'm trying to work on a review of the show episode by episode. One stream a day keeps the ghoul away? Let's hope so. Paladin dance. Listen up. We do this clean and quiet. No heroics and by the book. Understood? Understood. Outstanding. Remember, our primary target is the deep range transmitter. Stay focused and check your fire. I don't want to be hit by stray bullets. That's fair. Can't blame him for that. It was corporations like this that put the last nail in the coffin for mankind. They exploited technology for their own gains, pocketing the cash and ignoring the damage they've done. Look at these wrecks. It appears as though the facility's automated security has already been dealt with. Yeah, Arissa, uh, I enjoyed the show a lot. And yeah, no, uh, the, I started recording the review of the first episode. And by the time the, draw, the bombs had dropped, it was like maybe four minutes in, almost four minutes in. But my video was already ten minutes long. And I was like, this is going to be a fucking... <laughs> this is going to be a fucking project so i'm chipping away at it and then I, i'm hoping to do one for every episode and just put them all together at the end i will absolutely be trying fallout london i'm very excited for fallout london and i see that damn it i was hoping to avoid this look at the evidence there isn't a single spent ammunition casing or drop of blood in sight these robots were assaulted by institute since i'll be on the lookout roger that Let's move out. This place is a mess, but I still see a few pieces of salvage that the Brotherhood might be. Yeah, Max Monroe, it's just, uh, <laughs> I'm happy to make longer videos for you guys. I was just surprised. I was like, ah, oh, fuck. Okay, so, like, if this continues this trend, this is going to be like a two hour long video on just the fucking first episode. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm trying to, uh, I'm trying not to talk about every little thing. I don't know, but I guess that's kind of the point, though. Okay. All right, so open them doors to see those scents. Over there. Is Get someone up. attacking? Oh, okay.
Movement detected. Curious. Hmm. Over at hello. Not done fast. Hold up. I think we're being stalked. By order of the Institute, you must be destroyed. Send him back to synth hell. Yeah, Blue Elvis, I'm I'm happy with the show. I think that I'm right there with you. Hey, Pat Dempsey, that's what I'm saying. If y'all want to sleep during my videos, um, I'm fine with that. YouTube likes watch time, so to YouTube, you're just watching the whole video, and that helps out the video a lot. So we are both winning in that scenario. You get something to fall asleep to, and I get good analytics on the video. Remain vigilant. We've got turrets. Oh shit. We should actually be looting those. Where the fuck? So we'll be able to build turrets from their parts. course ahead. Should be our final stop. <coughs> um, uh, Mr. Chino, Fig, you, uh, fall asleep to my New Vegas video? That's awesome. A lot of people said, uh, told me that at New Vegas Day, and hey, that's fine with me. Like I said, we, we both went out of this. You, you have something to fall asleep to? My video gets good analytics. Sounds good to me. <laughs> fell asleep to the Starfield stream and woke up to vermilion sunrise at 5 a.m there you go well that's dope guys thank you for uh watching the stuff and hanging out on the channel i appreciate it a lot we'll have to keep heading down for now and find a way to get the facility's power back online yeah he's just gonna take it to the dome piece there has to be a power backup system somewhere Scout the maintenance area off of the main chain. Grab this junk oh, jet in here. Okay. All right. I'm taking that too. Um, D oh, first try. Restored. Thermal engine fueled, primed, and standing by for your command. Command accepted. Here we go, boys. Five second countdown. Five. You're gonna give uh, Starfield another chance soon. You wanna love it? Honestly, um, I enjoy my time with it. I like the main quest a lot. I like. Uh, I always find something to do in the game, whether it's questing, whether it's flying to the planets and resource hunting. Uh, just I always find something that I that I enjoy doing on it. Um, I hope you enjoy it. I, I think it's a great game, and I think with time, people will see that it's uh, pretty good. Cool. Test firing completed with an efficiency rating of 96.7%. Oh 
my god, are you all right? Got cooked by those flames. But yeah, the UC quest in Starfield? Uh, yeah, yeah I, I, I do. We're still alive. There's a lot of good and ones. Get to the transmitter. Let's go. And there's some that you like could totally miss multiple playthroughs, just totally miss because you, you just didn't go to that area or fucking talk to that one person. And, um, yeah. I like it a lot. All right, you dirty synths. Trying to roleplay as the Brotherhood since uh, we're doing the Brotherhood run now. Woo! I should be using the shock baton anyway. Because it's going to do more damage to them, question mark? Is there robots? It's doing a good amount of damage. Service elevator to the surface. And then he gives us that uh, unique laser rifle. Yeah, dude, I watch Tim's videos. Uh, fucking uh, in, anytime he releases them, I have them on in the background. So sometimes I don't like you know soak in all of the information. Uh, but Let's move out. Uh, I, I I love his tone of voice and and uh, listening to his insight on everything. And I especially am like stoked when he uh talks about Fallout obviously. So. Okay. Paladin Day. Righteous Authority, well, right? That could have gone smoother. We did not do 3 already. No, um I played this today because uh smoother? Tactics Something gave me trouble. So we're going to be doing um Tactics and once, Brotherhood of Steel. However, your extra gun and then we'll be on to three AD. and uh I'm not certain I could have accomplished the mission alone. New Vegas and yada yada yada. I thought we worked well as a team. Agreed. It's a refreshing change to work with a civilian who can follow orders properly. That being said, I believe we have two important matters to discuss. First and foremost, if you'll hand me the deep range transmitter, I'd like to compensate you for your assistance during this operation. I think you'll find this weapon useful. It's my own personal modification of the standard Brotherhood laser rifle. May it serve you well in battle. Righteous authority. That isn't necessary. I insist you keep it. The Brotherhood believes in paying all of its debts. Now. How did he survive a straight blast from a jet? I wanted to make you a proposal. When bullets shatter the armor like an egg? Hey man, it's heat resistant, what can I say? Usually he's wearing a helmet though. You kept your um, for some reason, the animation didn't no play, he didn't put it on. But uh, typically he is all it. encased in power you armor. You could spend I don't know, the rest of your life wandering Normal and I only have the unofficial patch installed, Dramoris. Or, you could join the Brotherhood of Steel and make your mark on Yes, I've seen that Fallout London is delayed, but that's okay. First off, the next-gen update for Fallout 4 is definitely necessary and needed. And then, uh, two, uh, I am positive they are such a talented team, they're going to have that figured out very soon. I'd be honored to join. That's what All I'm right, we've to. officially joined the Brotherhood, so... The police station and we'll discuss the details. Meet me back at the face cam, and I'll end the poll to officially name Brotherhood of Steel the winner of the poll. So I guess we'll be keeping that flag and going back to the game. <coughs> okay.
Should have gone with the Legion? Yeah, Max, you're right. Ranger, yeah, by popular vote. It was a, a landslide, actually. Out of nearly a thousand votes, 44% voted for Brotherhood. 26% voted for Minutemen. 16% voted for the Institute. And 11% voted for the Railroad. So the Brotherhood of Steel is the, the clear winner in this. I prefer the Institute to the Railroad. <laughs> the Railroad bugs me. Their mission is uh, all well and good. Are we in luck? It's the people that I have a problem with. Finally, some good news for a Patty's got that sleeping puppy. Nice. Life is fair. I agree. Aelin, Reese, it's time to welcome our newest recruit to the recon team. He shows a lot of promise, and with the proper guidance. Yep, Ranger, we all have our favorites. That's right. One of the best. Thanks. I promise not to let you down. You don't have to prove anything else to me. Getting that transmitter was enough. So you decided to stay, huh? I expected you to take your payment and run. All right. Let's just hug this out and get it over with. What do you say? You can play it however you want, tough guy. Yes, normal difficulty. It's going to take a lot more than completing one mission to impress me. Reese, that's enough. For me... A, I don't to typically play games on you, the harder difficulties. You need to understand uh, I usually stick with normal. To me, that's what the game is like. This is what they're presenting as like what the experience is supposed to be or whatever. Um, that's just my thought process. But then also, with the Bethesda games, it just makes everything bullet sponges If the, the harder you go. And uh, it doesn't really matter to me. Don't worry. I've spent time in the military. Perfect. Then there's no need to give you a The dialogue mode, I tried to keep it as vanilla as possible for uh, the series that I'm doing right now. But I wanted to have the unofficial patch because it is you fall in line, you good stay in line. <laughs> to have those fixes. You follow it. It's as simple as that. Now, before I release you to Halen and Reese for your assignments, there's one last order of business. From this moment forward, I'm granting you the rank of initiate. This is only a training rank. I'm not permitted to grant ranks any higher than that. Thank you. Thanks are necessary. Just continue excelling at your duties, soldier. You got it, dance. Ad victorium. Means, Halen. Ad victorium means to victory. In our eyes, defeat is unacceptable because we're fighting. Bullet sponges equals time wasting. Mind. Yeah, I mean that's a factor of it too, sure. But it's just like, ever carry. if that's all that really changes, like, because it just seems like that's really all that changes when you do it. Like I, I it's fine. Soldier. So I and I play most games just on normal. Uh, 2K24, WWE 2K24. I uh, do try to go up to hard and legendary on that because uh, Scribe Halen. Are we still giving you the, the AI can get a bit uh, predictable, so you you crank it up as you get better. So like for fighting games, it's different, but like normal every other game, I just kind of stick to it like this. I wish we can see eye to eye. Reese only sees one thing, Reese. Reese bleeds brotherhood. It's all he cares about. It's his family. It's his whole. No, it doesn't, dude. If anything else, head check. It will away. never make me feel she bad if you sleep to my videos. Um, I do put in work to put some cool shit on the screen during the videos, but um, like I was saying before, um, it helps me because YouTube loves watch time. So if you if you fall asleep to one of my three hour videos, eight hour videos, like YouTube's gonna love that because it's like getting watched. It, it YouTube just assumes it's getting watched for that amount of time. So I get good analytics. You have something to sleep to. Doesn't bother me at all. Is there something between the two of you? I fall asleep watching Aqua Teen and fucking uh took me under his wing showed me the ropes. Uh, last night it was space lab was a little more between us so uh but uh aqua teen and home movies and stuff like that doesn't mean i dis like that i don't like the stuff or anything like that i like it the most because i'm going to sleep <laughs> i fall asleep to it i need to get back to things if you're pat dempsey yeah i mean ads and stuff sure but like doing what you're doing just watch time in general helps out the channel so so are you ready to take on your I just appreciate assignment? people choosing me to fall asleep to. Like, uh, that's amazing to me. It blows my fucking mind. Ready. Great. Let me explain what Hey, I'm Daniel doing. Griffin, good to see One you. Of the Brotherhood's most important duties is the recovery and preservation of technology that was lost when the bombs fell. 
I have a list of locations that contain artifacts. We need you to... Uh, yell or scream out of nowhere. Yeah. Somebody, uh, what, my cousin tried to convince me to do that in my new one. Like, since everybody's sleeping, like, two hours in, fucking, be like, hey, fucking wake up. But, uh, it's like, nah, I shouldn't do that. Where's Reese? Hi. All right, out with it. What's your game? I hope I haven't offended you again. Offended? Hardly. I'm just trying to figure you out. You're not the military type. You're a loner. Office and Parks so and Rec, yes. Great around. shows, by the way. You got what you wanted, so why don't you hit the road? Great fucking shows. The Brotherhood might be the best chance I'll ever have to find my son. Well, as far as reasons go, that's a pretty good one. Look. I'm gonna cut you some slack because dance trusts. Theo Vaughn's podcast is another fucking great choice there, Pat Dempsey. Nice. I'll make sure I haven't. So uh, I haven't watched him in a minute, but uh, I love that fucking guy. Ready. Then listen up. Like it or not, one of our most important duties is to keep the Commonwealth clear of the trash. I'm talking about mutants, ghouls, synths. The abominations the damn eggheads caused when they. You saw Craig Robinson live. Nice, nice. This op is simple. I'm gonna send you to a target. And you're gonna terminate everything that calls it home. All the details you need are right here. Don't come back until the job's done. What was it like to actually meet Tim Kane? I was fucking way too excited. That's what it was like for me. <laughs> I was bouncing off the walls. I was so excited. He's super nice. Um, we. I wish I would have got a better place to do it. Because um, I like rented a podcast area, but like when I got there, it was like. Right in the middle of Pioneer Square in Seattle, and it was like kind of like a pretty rough area. Like they had like an area where uh homeless people were getting food and other services like like some some kind of other services from there. Uh this like little office building looking thing. So it had a lot of that kind of traffic like coming through, which whatever, somebody's homeless, I'm 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 not judging that. But like there were some of the there were some of these homeless people that were acting very erratically, and I felt bad because I was like brought Tim into that area, uh, when I could have booked some like he lives up north I could have gotten something probably nicer, up north. But this studio like I had two studios bidding for us to go to them, and this one, one and then they didn't like I'm not gonna bash the fucking podcast studio, but like they were supposed to like film it for us, and all that other kind of shit. But, like, I ended up doing that, which is why it looks the way it does. Like, one of the camera angles is, like, really low. And there's, like, two different kind of cameras and stuff like that. Like, they were supposed to have, like, four camera angles and, like, switch through them and, like, record it for us and, like, make it look really good. And they didn't. So, yeah. Anyway, if I ever do it again, I'd probably rent a really nice hotel that had, like, a like meeting room. You know, like a living room out front. And then I'd just set it up in there with a couple of iPhones. And then we'd just have a chat on uh, a couple of couches or something like that. But I was I was very, very excited to meet Tim. I think it shows in the video too, because I'm, I'm very chatty with him, but uh, he's a terrifically nice guy. Hitting him with that shock baton. Oh, hit dog meat instead. Whoopsie doodles. All right. I would, I would love to do a podcast with Tim, but I don't think that's his cup of tea to do something like that. What he does online already with his YouTube channel, I think that's like what he enjoys doing when it comes to that that kind of thing. But I wouldn't mind. Um, a less invasive, like, Zoom call. And I feel like that's something I could probably wrangle up. Like, a follow-up with Tim Kane, but, like, we could just do a Zoom call. That way he doesn't have to leave his house and it's not like, invasive to his schedule, like my last one was. Because I think he thought it was going to be a Zoom call at first, and then I was like, yeah, I'll fucking see you there. And he's like, oh, okay. <laughs> so, so, uh, I feel like a Zoom call would probably be more preferred from him. But he came all the way down, and we had a fucking great time. Okay. Yep. 
That would be, yeah, no, I think it'd be awesome too, Max. And I, I think he would be down for something like that. And, uh, you know, once once I'm not so busy with my other video projects, I'll likely formally email him about it and see what he has to say about it. Because we could chat for like an hour, and I feel like that uh, wouldn't be too invasive for his time. I offered to pay him for... I, whenever I like ask somebody to like come out and talk to me up here in a video or something like that, I always offer to pay them for their time and ask them what they think it was a fair compensation, and he told me not to pay him. Um, so, like he's 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 very nice. Um, he took his he took time out of his day, like massive, like he took the whole day to come down to uh, downtown Seattle just to chat with me about silly stuff like Fallout and chocolate. So I just really appreciate him. <laughs> He didn't have to do, he didn't have to do any of that, like, there was, like, obviously, like, no one would have even known, like, I would have been like, hey, do you want to meet up, and he's like, oh, I wouldn't be, in, in, I'm not interested in that or something, and that would have been the end of it, and, like, but, like, he chose to, uh, take a whole fucking day of his time to do that, and I just, uh, really appreciate it. And he dealt with my hyper ass. I have ADHD really bad, so... A lot of people see, like, they watch the video and they're like, Why are you, like, interrupting him? And it's just... I was just really excited to talk to him. Um, he wasn't upset about it. He said it was, like, one of his favorite interview-type situations he's ever been in. And I think that's pretty cool. You know, like, uh, <laughs> I feel like I did something right. I mean, but he's also so nice that he might just be saying that, but... Uh, I, I don't think he's a liar, so... I'd imagine he's telling the truth. But he is so nice that he would be like, No, that's like the way I want it to happen. Mantis is great. <laughs> like, but definitely one of the nicest dudes I've ever met. Um, super chill. You could sense the excitement? Yeah, probably. It was on full display. Oh my god. We always, uh, I keep missing these level ups. Um. What the fuck this ghoul up? Watch this shit. You get bonked, idiot. Bonked his arms off. Another one over here. Oh yeah. Oh he kinda got me there. I shouldn't have wasted that stem though. There's a bed right there. Can we have another quest? Or maybe we got both of them done. Actually, just in that No companions. Mag? Um, yeah, I like the Lone Wanderer uh, route. Because you can still use dog meat, and that's who I like using the most. Mm, fuck. Alright. 
Here we go, here we go, here we go. Right. Get on down here then. Get on down here then. Oh, there's another one moonwalking his way into our hearts. too bad put it back on his body let's see uh... this harness is way a lot didn't weigh enough though We're almost there there. Okay. Looks like we need to make a sanctuary drop. For some reason, for the first time like ever, my chair is hurting my ass. Ranger says I always try to get the perk where you can fast travel while uh, encumbered. Yeah, that's the fucking way to go. Well, look who's back. <coughs> Take it that area's clear. You got it, partner. Affirmative. Keep it up, and I may start believing you got some real guts. Now report to Paladin Dance. He said he had a mission for you. When you're ready for another op, you know where to find me. <coughs> Didn't think you'd show your face again. Ready to clear out another area? Yes. <laughs> I'm ready. Good. I'll mark the location on your map. See you when the target's clear. I'm actually a little jealous you get to head out to find these bits of lost tech. Exploring the ruins is why I joined up in the first place. Harry feels like survival is the best way to play uh, Fallout 4. Yeah, I can understand that. A lot of people like the, uh, those mechanics a lot. It's so exciting being new to the Commonwealth. There must be so much technology out there. Definitely that adds some fucking fun features, that's for sure. Be careful. Locating the artifact can be just as dangerous as bringing it back. Oh, did I not get it? Oh, it's that super duper mark. What the fuck? Okay. I see there's a healthy discourse about the show in the chat, as there has been for days. Dude, I love how much the show is making people talk about Fallout. Like I saw an Arby's Fallout ad. This morning, and I was so fucking stoked. Maybe one Arby's, but I'm not getting fast food as often anymore. Uh, I was eating it like every day, so I was like, this is too much. You're gaining fucking weight, too much fast food. I already drink too much soda, at least cut out the fast food a little bit. So, uh, I'm trying to do it like once every two weeks. Cause I don't, I'm not eating it like you shouldn't really do it at all, but it's like, I'm not against like having a burger or something like that every once in a while. But like, once every two weeks as opposed to fucking every single day is kind of where I'm at with it. Once a month, something like that. Okay, so I got the idea of doing this. I'm just gonna put all our weapons except that one and that one into our weapon thing. We'll come back for this. Oop. 
do the same thing with our apparel. Oh, my military backpack. Oh my god. Give it back. Okay, so first let's get clothes on. Um... I like the assault gas mask. I think it adds good armor. Okay. So. Oh, the Doom Marine armor is going to be our best armor. Let's just fucking wear that. That's from the Creation Club. Get fucked. Hell yeah, boys. Look at that. <laughs> Creation Club. Alright, uh, over here now, let's do... Okay, okay. We need to put the actual food... I think we uh, raw meat and, like, uh, plantable food needs to stay with us. Because we can put that in the... Workbench so that it can be cooked and or planted. I don't think we can do that from the fridge. Uh, oh, a sweet roll. Okay, so then let's grab... I think corn's plantable. Gourd is... Oh, maybe you can. that okay so now this this that that there we go okay Let's see if we have any special misc items here. Holy shit, HPZ with a fat five membership gift, a succulent five membership gift to Uncle Cha. Uh, how do you say that? Arrestafino? Arrestafio? I don't, I'm sorry if I'm saying your name wrong. Crooks uh, Seven? Matthew Dujardin? And Aftermath Insights, welcome to a tribe called Mantis. Um, oh, hey, Fraggle, good to see you. Uh, and thank you, HPZ, for the membership uh, gifting there. I appreciate you big time. Go over here. Yeah, that's uh, super generous, man. Thank you. Wait, why am I over here? Oh, I remember why I was over there, but still. Go over here. Look at Cherry. To be added. That's just somebody practicing at the range, so we don't have to worry about that noise. Um, holder. Meh, doesn't matter. Okay, we need to build a little bobblehead thing. I wonder what house I'm going to claim as just, like, my home. Oh, and Jonah has become a member. Hey, Jonah, thank you! Welcome to a tribe called Mantis, my dude. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for the support, guys. I appreciate it a lot. It helps out the channel a lot, and it helps me out, so thank you. And I hope to keep bringing you more streams and videos. Yeah, at Victorium, that's the slogan for today. Um, fuck. Now I'm trying to... Yes. Looking for a Vault Boy container? Is that in containers? I don't think it is. What is that in? Decorations? A 
I wouldn't be in that, would it? What's the fucking... Um... Vault Boy holders in? The bobblehead holders, rather. Or you can just build these. Cross promotional boys. Hey, Jonah, I appreciate you, man. Spectacle Island, your go-to uh, go home base? Nice. <laughs> Dude, I don't know where these fucking things are. Furniture shelves? Okay. Oh, it looks like you're probably right here. One sec, my fucking leg itches. Alright. Thank you. For, uh... What? I didn't see any fucking vault boy holders in here. They're like actual bobblehead holders. Here we go. Fuck. Oh my god. Furniture miscellaneous. No, you're good, Arthur. I didn't fucking know where they were at all. Hey. Just gonna light in here. Yeah, you were close. You got me to the right area. Hey, what the fuck? Oh, here we go. Probably a little too much, honestly. <laughs> How do I power that? With pylons? Oh, we have one of these stored, anyway. So what I am thinking I need to do is... Pylon it up. Like this. Boom. Light on. Ooh, look at that. It fucking did it perfectly. Look at that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, Nightbot is fucking great, Daniel. He's, uh... I need to I need to get some more sayings for him, actually. Okay, now let's see if we can build one of these. Oh not yet, we still don't have enough crystals. Well fuck. Okay, so let's grab a couple more weapons. Based on damage. Uh I'd rather do the handmade. <coughs> okay, so... Sledgehammer seems to be the best uh, melee. Let's do that one. Makes more sense. Ooh, shock baton, though. I think I'm gonna do... You know what? Blade of Tyrant. Then... Fuck it. This. And this. Alright. Got a little load out here. Um, we can do... Okay. Oh, I think that was good. Oh, our apparel. 
Oh yeah, Doom Doom guy. Completely forgot. Okay. There's healthier soda uh, soda pops. Yeah. Oh, you noticed the CKY shirt. Good. Thank you. Thank you for enjoying it, Jackie boy. I'm glad that somebody around here has some fucking <laughs> culture. <laughs> the Infiltrate, Destroy, Rebuild album shirt that I'm wearing. Okay. Uh... Now we'll go to Lexington and do some damage to these ghouls. Oh, liquid death? Is that any good? That's just water, isn't it? Like flavored or carbonated water? Is it like no sugar? What are we dealing with here? Because like, uh, I am looking for an alternative to soda. If I, if I cut fucking fast food down to like days that I lift in the gym, uh, like, you know what I mean? Like, uh, once or twice a month on days that I'm doing like actual, you know, calorie burning shit, uh... I feel like I could really do some damage. So it's just sparkling water? Dope. Yeah, we're about to fuck shit up. Oh, it has less sugar. Yeah, I'm, I need to, uh... I need to get sugar out of my diet, like, pretty much completely. I'd fucking drink Mountain Dew all goddamn day. I have been drinking more water, which, you know, if I'm drinking water, I couldn't, I'm not drinking Mountain Dew, so that's good. <coughs> okay. Come on, ghouls. Hey. Wrecked. This is a good ass weapon. It was a good choice. Bladed tire iron. Dude, I saw a show. Here's a fucking show. Got it. Casso? Casso is how they were saying it. Casso is how I would say it. But it's a Japanese show out of Tokyo. Casso. Um, with a K, I'm pretty sure. Anyway, it's a fucking, like, obstacle course show with, uh, like, pro skaters, or like, pro, like, skateboarders. Doing the obstacles on the, with them, it is fucking amazing. <laughs> it's so good. I watched it this morning for the first time, and I was like, "Where the fuck has this been all my life?" Excellent. Good. Yeah, it's a Japanese skateboard show. It's fucking fantastic. You just watched an episode, Robbie? Yeah. Well, it's I fucking like it a lot. Sweet. Maybe YouTube's suggesting it to fucking everybody <laughs> right now because it got suggested to me. I was like, what is this? Ooh, melons. Hello. Hey, now.
Yeah, where's uh, this fucking thing we're looking for here? The flux capacitor or whatever the fuck she was talking about. Interesting. Oh, here we go. Surely none of these ghouls are just pretending to be dead. Oh, look at that. from here. Oh, another ghoul. Yeah, flux capacitor. <laughs> I see a Ricky from Trailer Park Boys. Uh, looks like we gotta refuculate the computers here. Uh, gonna land on uh, Juniper. Okay. Oh. All right. If you leave a dead body, can a glowing one turn them into a ghoul later? So, like, with a... I think so. <laughs> you see it happen a lot more in like New Vegas and Fallout 3 where like glowing ones will reanimate I'm, I'm pretty sure I remember them doing that reanimate the other fallen ghouls I think if alright I think <laughs> thanks for the F's guys yeah that's pretty good I think, um, when they do their, like, they hold their hands out and they do that big blast of radiation that it does reanimate, um, their boys. Yeah, there he is up there. No, that's a super mutant. No, he had power armor. Hey, Dante, what currency is that? CLP. 2,500 CLP. Hello, Mantis. Which one do you recommend? The Outer Worlds or Starfield? That, uh, I recommend both of them. Play, uh, if you have a choice between the two, play Outer Worlds first because uh, it's a better linear experience and I think it's uh, oh, Chilean currency. Okay. Uh, thank you for that very generous donation there. Uh, Dante. Uh, but Outer Worlds is a nice linear, ex a linear experience with a really good story. Starfield is a giant, massive open world. I mean, if you're more into that, then obviously go for that. Um, I think they're both good. And, uh, yeah, that's my take on that. Thank you again so much uh, for that super chat. Oh, they did it again. Okay, so my... My thing that I'm trying to do here is get them to be aggro and want to shoot that nuke, but make them hit the ghouls. I'm like trying to run, I'm like trying to get out of the way. Oh, they shot another one, they shot two of them there. But I love Outer World Story, man, like, mm, I really enjoy it. Oh, I tried, man. I'm trying to, like, get out of the fucking way. Okay, one more time. 
One more time. Damn it, I came back to check for some reason. I had actually made it too. Well, yeah, we could definitely sneak it technically. I could just fast travel from right here. But I'm trying to uh, get this raider to launch that fat man on these ghouls, and I'm gonna run up and fuck that raider up and take their fat man. Didn't work as planned, but it will do. Wasting all my mini nukes. Get fucked. Oh. Okay, we got the fat man, right? Boom. Nice. Rules. This looks like it's doing that bleeding thing that the bottle did too. ball too oh nice who the fuck is artist oh creation club wait where, where is this sending me Why is melee so OP in this game? Well, my strength is pretty high up, but yeah, no, it's pretty good. Um, we are pretty much vanilla. We're using the unofficial patch. Uh, happy trash again. Well, he dropped... Everybody talking about the, art, the artist... He dropped his recipe for a scope for one of the rifles we have in the creation club. going on here make sure by the way if you're watching on YouTube to like the stream if you're enjoying it 
throw a super chat my way if you're feeling frisky. And uh, if you're over on Twitch, follow me up. That uh, helps out a lot. I'm trying to grow Twitch over there. Because I have most of my following on YouTube. Uh, but thank you guys just for coming out. Make sure to jump into the chat. Don't be shy. I love chatting with everybody. You don't have to super chat for me to chat with you. Uh, then Ranger also posted who Artis is. Artis is a mechanic who wants to do Mary Jane and Lily. Yeah, the CR74L combat rifle. That is uh, definitely what he's involved in. So, that sounds right, Ranger. It is uh, Creation Club Central. Pub flower to the left, hell yeah, man. Take all I can. We just killed the ghoul that Reese wanted us to kill. But uh, I like to make sure. I was gonna say, that place... Yeah. See? See? That woke up a few more of them, too. Hey, fucker. This is definitely my zombie hacking fucking tool. Oh my god. There will be more, too. Hey, Bindi Berry. Oh, that was like seven minutes ago, but thank you for uh, f the follow over there on Twitch. I appreciate you. There should be another ghoul in here that, like, comes out of the woodworks. Maybe we got him when we threw that Molotov through the fucking window. Love Fallout so much. <laughs> Alright, so let's see. Yeah, right, buddy. I don't care if you are a legendary. You're donezo. What'd you got? Ghoul Slayer's Pipe Bolt Action Pistol does 50% more damage against ghouls. Oh! We got a floating hand there. <laughs> oh, oh! My dog's also having a party behind me. Having a fucking time to throw my bed around party. I mean, it's his bed. He can do whatever he wants with it. Trying to see if I can get him on camera being a menace here. <laughs> uh, not as much as I wanted to. But he's down there, bottom left corner, being a fucking menace. Okay, let's uh, pan this back over. A little more even here. And I'd say one notch up like that. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. I was just trying to show my dog off, but uh, couldn't see him as well as I wanted to. <coughs> And that's a Dutch, my youngest dog. He has a blue healer. Like, uh, I always forget what terrier he is. English terrier or something like that. Boston terrier. And, uh, Australian shepherd. It's funny, he's a weird mix. But I love him. He looks like a tiny boxer. Yeah, I can always show you the dog. I figured that you guys wouldn't mind seeing the dog, but uh, I, I was hoping I'd be able to show him off better, but that was as much as my webcam was uh, willing to show, I guess, without me like physically moving it, which I didn't want to do because I have it in a good spot. Thank you for the live reacts, by the way. I see them flying off the chain over there. Whatever. There was another person to loot. I think I did over there. So we're good.
Turn in our brotherhood quests. Oh, uh, uh, Al Chestbreach does a pet corner on his streams where he shows off everyone's pets in the Discord. Okay. Well, yeah, we should do something like that anyway. The fuck? That is a terrific idea. That, uh, as usual with that guy. Common Al Chestbreach W. You want that Ragger helmet? You can uh, get one on Etsy from Zap It Props is where I got mine. I have the Elite Right gear set from him. Hey. Tip, bring the dog to the camera. Well, he's well, looking pathetic right now and Taking pretending to be asleep. Clear. Affirmative. Keep it up, and I may start believing you got some real guts. Commonwealth is a big place in need of some serious extermination. I think it's time for our Take next break here because I wanna I wanna keep streaming for the for another couple sit. hours. So if I have a break now, um. I'm ready. Good answer. Here's the data. I'd like that, and then we could go for another Don't come couple back hours. Until the op's done. Okay, there's that, and then where is the other one? Halen. Excuse me, scribe Halen. Yeah, Zapit is goaded. I want to get more of his stuff. Good, you're back. Hope that means you recovered the tech. Yeah, my nicotine addiction. Well, I refresh on a lot of things. I, I do the smoke break. I Here it is. try to grab a new soda, so take a piss. Safely. Here, I'm always looking for tech. <coughs> for more? Just say the word. Affirmative. All right. I mark the location when we get now. back from this stay break, alert. we're going to stop with, like, the uh, radiant quests from the Brotherhood. And uh, we'll go with... Uh, what? Dance wanted us to do. Didn't he have us something to do? I thought he did. That's interesting. I thought. Oh, it's right there. It's like I thought he had something for us to do. So yeah, we'll do that when we come back. We'll do a hard save here, just to be safe. And I'll kick on. Waste wave this time instead of Vermilion Sunrise. That way the songs will be different. And I hope you guys enjoy a little bit of uh, my album Waste Wave, which came out back in February of 2023. You can find it on Spotify, YouTube Music, Apple Music, any anywhere you stream music. People use it on TikTok videos as well because uh, it's in that uh, catalog. Um, anyway, I'm gonna jump out, have a smoke, have a quick piss, and we'll stream for we'll we'll hit the last couple hours of the stream. And I'm really enjoying hanging out with you guys, so I hope you stay with me here. Uh, see you soon. I will be uh, back here uh, pretty shortly.
And we are back. Welcome. Back. Me. <laughs> to the stream. Let's fucking go. That was fast? Oh, well. I'm a fast smoker. I want you to take it easy for a while. Paladin. Don't worry about me, sir. Welcome back. I can still I've got another way. mission for you. Yes, sir. Ready. Ready? Outstanding. Over the years, the Brotherhood has sent several recon teams to the common. Did I enjoy my Jet Psycho and Devil's Lettuce? Absolutely. Oh, fuck. I forgot to take a... Took off the old Piper Rooney. Officially. I should, uh, just grab another joint out of there. I'm sorry. Don't be. Everyone who signs up for a recon mission knows what to expect. Our lives depend on our training and on each other. Yeah, I welcomed and myself we back by Fungus. That's how... Honor our if nobody's gonna do it, I'm gonna do it for me. <laughs> to find out what happened to them, if we can. Alright, I'll see to it. Their insertion point was in the hills near Malden. Survey the area and establish a search pattern. Monitor your radio. First dance, I'm gonna get a little hot. Uh, All recon teams are issued distress oh pulsers that put out a short range homing beacon. If you can acquire a signal, you should be able to trace it to its source. Yeah, man, it's like I take like two or three hits off of these joints and just put them out. So we got another one. Uh oh. I'm gonna break this ashtray. I know it. I can fucking sense it. Okay. We should just unscrew like a normal fucking ashtray or something. But it doesn't do that. It can be so hard to find good artifacts these days. Ones us scribes can actually glean information from. It's always worth it when we do. Let's fucking go. This is one where you gotta listen to the... I gotta turn the fucking radio up. Yeah, activated aid, cigarette. Yeah, that's exactly what happened. Alright, um... Where the fuck is it sending us? Dante with, uh, 500... Uh, CLP. I mean, 5,000 5, CLP. Do you think that uh, Fallout has the same problem as Star Wars? Um, I don't really know what problem Star Wars has. I, I don't follow Star Wars very much. Um, I if if you're referring to the show, I I think the show is fucking fantastic. Um, oh, you can't do more than just that unless we see stuff in other countries. I, I mean, like, yeah, the, I mean, there's a little bit of that, but that's what like you come to the series for, in my opinion. I hear gunshots over here. I know what this place is. We'll help this hunter out. Thank you so much for the 5,000. Uh, somebody it. said it was Chilean money. Thank you so much. We're going to help homeboy out here. Another fucking guy, what the hell? The reason I'm using bats so much is because I'm trying not to hit the people that are next to me. Star Wars has consistency issues? We'll probably see some more inconsistencies. I mean, that's been the name of the game since Bethesda took the IP, but the ones I've seen in the sh uh, show so far haven't bothered me too much. Thanks for the help. Mm, thank you. Excuse me. Yeah? Wait there. That's not what I wanted him to do. Come on. 
I think there's a fusion core in here. Well, there's more more rats, that's for sure. For some reason, I thought there was a fusion core in here. Maybe that's a different one? Different, uh, cave? Wasteland Imports has a repellent stick in here in its top tier. Which is a mod. What's my all-time favorite companion? Dogmeat. Ian from Fallout 1 and then Dogmeat. I usually don't say Fallout 1. I don't like saying that because it's not the name of the game. It's just called Fallout. So I usually say the first Fallout or something like that. Rex from New Vegas also counts as a dog meat. So yes, he is on the list. Well, I'm, obviously it's not a dog meat. I'm saying like the dog companions are always my favorite. Oh, Ian, spare some change for an out-of-work NPC? Of course, brother. Well, at least you're always welcome here. I can say that much. Yeah, I'm usually uh, an Indica guy myself. Or I do uh, hybrid. My wife is more sativa. I like the Indica. Oh, look at this uh, ransack caravan here. Fred O'Connell. Don't know what his story is. Oh, there's a workbench here. Oh, there's blood bugs here. Toffington Boathouse. Needed. Oh, you fucker. I hate these things. They're so, like, deceptively rough to fight. Fucked. Oh, ah, fuck you. Comrade Casper, fat toonie. Ain't a fink, dig. I would never accuse you of being a fink, Casper. Never ever. Mary Sutton, don't know her story. Shut up. Alright, uh, get fucked. Bastard. Oh, carrying too much. But we have a workshop like right here. Cooking up some of our stuff here. We can make noodle cups. Oh, there's some brain fuckers right there. Somebody was asking about that. Oh. Yep, 
Yeah, Arcade is is, is a great companion as well. I usually do Boon and Rex in New Vegas myself. Can we just put all of our junk in there? I'm also going to add... We're actually not going to add any of that. Okay, fuck it. Anyway, onward to where we were going. Uh, best is the best one? Who the fuck said that? Um, the mighty pin 15. Uh, good answer. Oh, good. Gracious, more blood bugs. Ooh, a lot of them, too. Oh, shit, we're almost dead. Yeah, we'll hit him with that jet. And we leveled up. <laughs> Fuck those things. We have two levels. Okay, let's see. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Cass is great. Fuck yeah. Veronica's good too. I mean, uh, all of New Vegas' companions are fucking top tier. Lily's my least favorite. She's still amazing. There's just gonna be more of those cocksuckers up here. Those little brain fucklers. Oh shit. Super mutants. That'll teach him. Oh my god. I start using a different weapon. I'm getting smoked. Let's see what we got here. We have a great sniper rifle. Use this tuned hunting rifle. Hostile sensor reading detected. What the fuck are they doing here? Ooh, 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 ooh. So I think, I don't think that's what it is. Is it? Okay, we gotta follow just the distress signal. I don't know where they are. All are off the top of my head. But I don't hear the signal at all anymore, so... Probably going the wrong way. Crap. 
Christ. Okay. A charged pool cue, huh? Ten percent chance to deal one hundred electrical damage on a block. Okay, um Distress to oh, okay. Here comes the super mutants. That didn't really add up. Ooh, get wrecked. Oh my god. Sixteen percent on the distress signal. I think it was getting stronger this way, though. Legendary items are cool, but you never vibe with legendary enemies. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Is it in here? Oh, we're carrying a REM power this armor too. Solid. This one too. What happened here? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, we have the Raider power armor. Let's go drop that off. Oh, we gotta listen to the battlefield holotape. Before we do that, we're gonna... Yeah, throw a snazzy skin on that old pit boy that's not a bad idea. Our armor workbenches are down at Red Rocket, so... 
Yeah, we need to get a pimp boy mod going. Uh, but I've been keeping it pretty vanilla, so. Let's see what we got here to throw in here. Good. Okay. Okay. Oh, wait. We're going to put power armor pieces in here. Here we will do I was going to have a separate locker for legendaries and stuff, but I don't think it matters. All right, so let's do it like this. Everything that's not favorited right now can get the fuck out. We'll probably, I'll keep that too. We'll probably um, end up organizing the legendaries into a different area. Casper, give me another fat toonie. I realize we didn't get Goggins Gulify moments. That's what I'm. Uh, I'm. I'm thinking we're gonna see more about that. Uh, like, how? Like, where does daughter go? Because he seems to be looking for his family, and it's like he was with her last. So what? Like, what happened there? You know what I mean? Um. Yeah. Very. Very excited for season two. Thank you, Casper. And then um. Eight. Okay. Solved that. So now let's go over here. Oh my god. I'm just going to put them all in here now. Don't have time for this. Except the Nuka Colas. Okay. I like that. I'll mark it on your map. Thank you, Preston. What's in my inventory that was so much heavier than before? Huh. We can use all the support we can get. So see what you can do to help. Alright, you got it, brother. Let's um I think these are in miscellaneous. I forget already where it was. Oh, we need two more fiber optics, fuck. Okay, so let's do That action, that action, boom bang. Okay. What ending are we getting for the chat? Uh, voted to side with the Brotherhood of Steel. So, that's why we have the Brotherhood flag waving for this run. Okay, which way are we going? The correct way. We should re-hotkey some of this. Oh, I didn't- oh, fuck. Somebody suggested spicing up the Pip-Boy, and they are correct. Let's do that real quick. 
We should be able to do that. Yeah, uh, unfortunately, Jonah, Brotherhood won by 44% of the votes uh, out of 1,000 votes. So it was quite the landslide victory. We can also... Ooh, ooh, ooh. What's this? Green's the best, in my opinion. Neon Sunrise, baby. Actually, Overseer Veneer is top tier. Beautiful. Beautiful. How's that wood finish? Alright, anyway. The results for the poll are still available if you scroll up through the chat, I'm sure. Depending on how long you've been here. I don't know how long it like saves it if you just join in, but they definitely won by a landslide. <laughs> Looks like we're investigating this uh, National Guard depot after finding the corpses of many a Brotherhood soldier. Oh, it's a training yard, not a depot. My mistake. My mistake. Is that going to be aggro? Sure is. And I hear ghouls. Let's miss every shot. Another distress signal. Okay, then. Okay, can't get in that way. Crash Verdi Bird, that's a good place to fucking start. Hmm, guess not. Well, they're probably going to be inside. I rarely do this side of the quest. I, I was going to say, shoot in the fucking car so it'll blow up and I'll just die that way. Good strategy there, turret. Yeah, that uh, full suit of power armor, I seem to remember... It's been a while, but, uh... I, th I thought there was something like that here, yes. Where exactly it is, I'm not 100% sure, but uh, I imagine it's inside where I imagine the Brotherhood guys are too. Slayer. Wow, what the fuck? Come on. There's one outside and one in the armory. Well, uh, huh, huh. sounds like we'll be grabbing some then. I don't worry about Dogmeat getting injured because, like, when combat's over, he goes back to full health. Everything's all good again. 
At least on normal difficulty, the survival might be different. Though, I think even on survival, companions are essential, right? It's not like New Vegas where they can die. We're very close. We're even closer than they must be under us. Huh. Is it gonna be that then? Nightera Aslan, Brotherhood of Steel, Recon Team Four Two Nine Alpha, Serial Number Three Four Three One. It's been three hours since I set my distress pulse. There's been no word from the Paladin or Ferris. Their objective was a satellite array on the coast. They may be out of range. My orders were to hold this position at all costs. We'll be able to hack the this. Entire site has been overrun. The door I'm too stupid to get through that door. Do I have to go through that door to get the power armor? I imagine. Oh, it's top floor? Oh. Let's see. Oh, you're saying never mind. No, you thought the Brotherhood was top floor. I'm guessing. Well, uh, the power room's outside. Oh, I thought there was two of them. Oh, I can unlock the door to the terminal upstairs. Really? Okay. Hmm. 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 Let's see. Double Zemo. Yeah, I understand now. Let's see what you guys are talking about here. There's a safe. Yes. Uh -huh. I must have grabbed it right there. It looked like I grabbed something, like a note or something. But maybe we'll unlock that terminal? i search the rest of the desks here. Okay. Okay. Alright. I did. I like Krim, uh, Krimith's Tooth or however the fuck you say it. That's a good ass weapon. <coughs> yeah, Arthur. Nice. I like your little jingle there. Shit. We're about to get yeeted. Oh my god. He's done for. Nice dog meat. Junkies machete. Does increasing amounts of damage the more withdrawal effects you're suffering from. Oh shit. Surprise! Alright. Wait. Which way did I come from? <laughs> Sweep the leg, Ravenous. Yeah, you're right. Oh, shit. Hmm. 
A lot of ghouls in here, it sounds like. Let's, uh... Some buff out. And some medics. And some psycho. Got here. Strange. In the bathroom? There's a glowing one in here? In the bathroom? Well, we'll take care of that, won't we, boys? Handle that business. All right. Okay, probably. Ass. Music got more intense. Oh, the bathroom is above us. Perhaps a different bathroom. this glowing one I've heard so much about. Hey Carter, thank you for the kind words and thank you for stopping into the stream here. Oh, there's the glowing one. Shit. Got him, boys. Is that really the way we should go? Is this where the power armor is that everybody keeps talking about too? Or did they said it was outside but you have to go through the second building to get it, right? in the bunker outside. Okay, let's see. I believe I have Master Lock. Oh, well, I have, uh, maybe I have the one before that expert. Won't be able to pick this. Mm, okay, yeah, I don't have it yet. Do I have a level? Not yet. Who's starting shit? doing now onward to the satellite array <sighs> oh, 
Looks like, yep, super mutants. And I'm gonna fuck them up. Oh, I heard that missile. Yeah, what the fuck? I hear the suicider too. Shit. Oh my god. Better than this. this out. Some bastard. Oh, there he is. Shit. Alright, guys. We're gonna have to rush that guy with the fucking missiles. Thank you for the F, Patty. Get out of his sight. What? I'll wear your Who's hands around my what? neck. Shit. Hear the suicider. Okay, he's right there. Where are you at? We got this, boys. Christ. Six more Kims. Fuck it. Not jet yet. That's here. damage. Addicted to winning? Yeah, watch the fuck out. You right about that, Ryan? Ah, oh, fuck. Haha. Got him. Oh, he's the one that had the missile launcher. Get fucked. Alright. Unless another one has one too.
Nice. Nice. We don't have enough stim packs, am I? Yeah, thanks, Juna. For, uh... Yes. For the advice on the... Super Mutant with the Missile Launcher there. Um... Jeez Louise. Darn. Whoops. Uh, with mods 2 or vanilla, this... Uh, this is much better on PC. I am... Uh, yes, it is. <laughs> That's why I play it on PC. But, uh... If anybody's wondering about uh, our mod situation here, I just have the unofficial patch installed, that's it. Okay. There was a magazine in the room I was just in? Had it, really? You gonna tell me this? Oh my god. Nice. Cool. Thank you for the heads up. Okay. Was that epoxy? Yes. Alright, so. Must not be over here. Must be like right there, is what I'm guessing. Dimsy, you're gonna play uh, your Fallout 4 run on PC more? Good. I hope that I help sway you to play more Fallout. This is 92%. Are they under this thing? Are they in this truck? Are they on top of this one? In here? Yes. How come I stripped, uh, skipped straight to 4? Uh, tactics gave me some trouble today and 4 just sounded like fun. I'm hoping to get back, the next time I stream, either tomorrow or the next day, will be tactics and we'll be back on the schedule. Anthony, watching watching me uh, play Fallout 2 got you inspired and getting power armor, I mean if you watch me do it, everybody, anybody can do it. It is a little rough. You gotta. That's all that you gotta done. fucking get through it, but it can't happen. Okay, so now we're going to investigate a bunker here. Should lay the fuck up there. Shit is wild. I like doing that run. Yeah, the Fallout TV series is definitely influencing people to reinstall their games and have some fun. So this is, uh, once we actually get up to this bunker here, and I think reunite with a 
long lost brotherhood member. That is where I'm going to end the stream for the day. We've been going for around five hours, but I need to go to the grocery store tonight and things of that nature. Um, do I have a guide to get into the old faults? I thought that I did. Definitely look, because I feel like I do. But um, I've been thinking of... I, I have a lot of stuff that's coming. Uh, stuff of that nature, stuff on different games uh, outside of Fallout. Here's old Gullet. This is not something we need to worry about right now. We need to get up to this bunker. Yeah, you likely will see me tomorrow. Like I said, I'm pretty sure I got a fix for tactics that'll work just fine. Um, to get it playable and good. I also said about tactics that I'll likely use a character editor. Like a maxed out character, because I have more fun with it that way. So, um... There's a, oh, hey, there's a Blade Runner reference. Let's see if we can get up there. Uh, nope. I'll try it later. <laughs> Yeah, Blazim, uh, Blazim, it's, uh, always good to see you in the chat there. Make sure to like the stream, by the way, if you enjoyed it today. Um, that goes for everybody. Damn it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, let's see here. I think I want one of these. We are almost to the bunker here. Let's do a little quick save. Okay, almost there. Am I going to play any of the DLCs? Yes. Um, I am not running any mods, Neo. Just the script extender and the unofficial patch. Uh, tactics is semi-canon. I guess some major events from Tactics happen, but not they don't like consider the whole thing, I guess. But um, when Emil was writing out like the timeline the other day on Twitter, he did include Tactics, which was interesting. Brandis. Freeze. One more step and I'll, I'll blow your damn head off. I do. I have all the creation Who equipment stalled, you? Philippe. How did you get in here? Easy, Paladin. I'm with the Brotherhood. The Brotherhood? No, no, no. It can't be. They're, they're, they're too far away. They wouldn't send you, would they? Let's, uh, let's say I believe you. How did you find me? I followed the distress beacons left by your team. Their hollow tapes led me here. The others? What, uh, what happened to them? They're dead, Paladin. I recovered their tags. You, you, you did? Thank you. This, this really means a lot to me. I tried to go back for them, you know. There was nothing I could do, not alone, but, but I'd hoped. You've been through a lot to find me. I should... I should give you something. I've collected a lot over the years. Technology, odds and ends. If, if you see anything you want, take it, take it. The Brotherhood needs you, Paladin. It's time you reported in. I... I, I can't. It's, it's been too long. I, I wouldn't be of any use. No one knows the Commonwealth better than you. We need your help. I've been here too long. I'm... I'm, I'm not myself. 
Would they still take me? The Brotherhood will honor the memory of your team. Shouldn't you be the one to tell their story? Unless I go back. Oh, it worked. Oh, shit. Sacrifices, everything we went through, it'll be forgotten. His unique silk suit. Kill him. <laughs> nah, man. I think uh, we recruit him to our settlements or he goes back to the police station, one or the other. Get my things together. Thank you. Thank you for everything. And he must just go back to the police station. That melon. And also, we're doing a brotherhood run. I can't just murk a brotherhood. Even though something just got murked outside. That was like a, f a flash from a, a car getting exploded or something. It's usually what that is. But we're so deep inside, that's weird. That was weird as hell. All right, anyway, uh, we're going to call the stream there for now. I want to thank you guys for coming out and uh, hanging out while we played a little bit of Fallout 4. Um, there will be more where that came from. The next time we do a stream, like I said, it might be tomorrow. Um, if not, within the next day or so, uh, we'll be starting with tactics again. Well, not again, but, you know, picking up with tactics and uh, going to Brotherhood of Steel. and then So, hopefully you come out to that. I can't wait to see you guys out there. And, um... Yeah, just thank you for being here. Thank you to everybody who super chatted and uh, who was chatting in the chat. Uh, I love you guys, and I will see you on the next one. It has been Mantis. Mm -hmm.